Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another Zagertastic Extreme. It is I, your friend, the one, the only, Z A Single Guard Zagard, and I hope you're all having a wonderful morning, new night, evening, whatever time it is for you today. Welcome back to the Dragon's Den, my friends. And yes, the camera is way bigger than it usually is, and that is because I was testing out some lighting settings. I have a light in front of me now, turned on actually, so if you can't tell, I'm a little brighter. And yes, I'm on the left side of the screen instead of the right side. I want you guys to let me know what you think looks better actually, uh, while I make this smaller. There, there we go. There we go, there we go. Uh, and I, uh, I know I forgot something, and it was Spotify. I forgot to... Why is Spotify... There we go. Uh, So guys, uh, let me know, does this look better or worse? Oops, nope, 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 nope. Click, click the scene, click the scene. Does this look better, does this look worse? And by the way, hi Quiet, how are you doing? Sup, uh, how are, I'm doing well. Interesting, the ads I mean, music pretty good. Thank you for that. Just got an Xbox ad and it comes in play, and in, in comes the PlayStation. Oh. The console wars are back on. Gather your troops, we continue forward. Uh, and yes, this is a little this is a little Thor hammer. It even has the inscription from the uh, from the, from the movies. If you can read that, it, uh, whomst, whomst holds this hammer, if he be worthy, shall possess the powers of Thor. And what this is, it's a bottle opener. I love it. It's a li it's a little bottle opener. And if you're curious what this is, it's Dad's old fashioned root beer. Yeah, let's see if you guys can see that. Yeah. I have a root beer addiction. Uh, it's, it, I'd say it looks good on the whatever the difference is. Noise. Let's see if it looks how it looks with the light off. So, this is with the headlights off. This is how it looks. That's not good. Here's how it looks if we turn the um, the front light off. Mm, not much of a difference, but it is better. It is better. So we're getting closer to actually having good lighting. Because I didn't realize this. I could take the light I usually have over on the left side of my um, computer and move it down there so it's shining up at me so I don't have as much headlight coming from above. I think that might be a good idea. Maybe I'll, I'll have to... I didn't think about this until two seconds before the stream started. Literally two seconds. So I'm going to need to take some time to think about this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you for understanding, Quiet. And thank you, Lily, for uh, contributing. Let's see, how many was that? Thank you, Lily, for contributing 46,000 total scales to the Stream of Horror Game Challenge. It means so much. Thank you for being such a loyal contributor of the Stream of Horror Game Challenge. But where have you been, Lily? You haven't been chatting in the chat quite so much. You, you okay? I hope you're doing okay. Well, let me know if you're not doing okay, if, or if you are doing okay. And let me get... Ah, jeez and crackers. I spilled some water. I spilled some water. Looks like they're spilling some water on the screen there. So yeah, I ugh, new lighting. Let's see how the, let's see if this looks better. It's definitely getting rid of the shadows down here, which is nice. The shadows from the um on the green screen. So that's good. That's one positive. Mm, I am addicted to root beer. I am I am addicted to good cold glass bottle root beer. Kids, beer is bad for you, but root beer is delicious. 
So the booker or mini story I was writing has grown a bit, and I have improved after redoing it. So, same opening, just more depth per se, and removal of back-to-back -back repetition. And I'm addicted to pistachios. I am not a huge fan of pistachios. I think I'm one of the few people in the world who's not a huge fan of pistachios. Like, I don't... I don't know, I just, I'm like, uh, I eat them and it's like, I get why other people like them, but I kind of hate them. Um, what is this? Reptile meat, mm, yum. Let's uh, get on our, oh my god, I love this. We have a fucking velociraptor as a mount now. This is like so freaking cool. I, I freaking love it. Uh, but let's see what, what quests we have. So we have our main quest still. Uh, I'm going to do this later when we need to... Um, you know, I'm going to... Uh, yeah, I'm just going to do this later. Uh, offers... Uh, hmm. That one we can do... We can try and do the fighting pits, but we need to find more of those. Oh, there's a trade offer? Um, oh, right, that one. Mm, don't remind me. Uh, we have some hunting. Oh, yeah, we have another um, melee pit we can do. But for now, let's just do the main quest a little bit. I want to advance that a bit further. Retribution or not, I'm just going to avoid ripping my homework up because my teacher is a word I shall not say. Your teacher is an alien, ain't they? They're, they're from the outer the outers of space. They are green with the tentacles coming from the sides of their head where their temples should be. And orange on the tips of their fingers. Or did I read into that wrong? Hey, chill, chill. I'm just riding on my cool Velociraptor. You don't need to come at me, bro. You don't need to come at me. Okay. Let us go on an adventure, folks. Onward through the mountains. I wish he, I wish they ran a little faster. They should run faster. This looks like it's at just like a basic walk. And there's some wide mods. Ooh, another one of these things. That we could do later. So we need to go this way. At this point, I'm convinced I'd rather deal with them. What do you mean you'd rather deal with them? I, Green Temple stem aliens. Oh. Dang, your teacher must be really pissing me off. Some teachers can be like that. I'm not going to lie. Is that a, is that a frost claw? Let's roll her back. Please, stranger. Help me kill this thing. Let me off. Thank you. Stranger, help me, help me kill this thing. Whoa, coming after me. Hey, whoa, don't hit my velociraptor. Now the tide's turned. She get out of my way. I worked hard to get that velociraptor. Don't go breaking it. Welcome. Do I get anything for helping? No? Okay. Oh, maybe I do get something for helping. Where are you? Let me just gather these parts that are 
clearly important. Oh, that's where you are. Hello. You've got to help my friend. Mm -hmm. Wait. What about your friend? Slow down and explain. Jose and I were heading south with supplies from Salt Bike when machines attacked. I left her behind so I could get help from the Grove and ran straight into another machine. Thank the ten you were here to help. So your friend is still up the road? Fighting Quiet! Machines? Thank you for contributing 140 total scales to Streamer Horror Game Challenge. Just remember, guys, if you are just lurking, you don't have to be typing in the chat just here. You get free channel points that Twitch will give you. And you can use those channel points to what is this? Uh, to turn uh, to get me to play a horror game on stream, and I promise you, I will scream and cry like a little baby. It'll be fun. I think this is the one they want us to do. All right, let us take our velociraptor there. And with the power of our comradeness. I would like to see one of the, um, uh, one of the future peoples, another, like another tribe, but they all have accents. So far, everybody has American accents, which, obvious reasons, this is a, the U.S., this is where the U.S. clones were made. But I would like, to, I, I just, it would be interesting, you know? Not saying they have to do it, but imagine seeing one of the Russian... Supply slug. Why is the supplies? And the Tanakh soldier. Where? Oh, it's down there. Uh, supplies. Hmm. What happened here? It looks like the Tanakh tried to salvage some supplies after getting attacked. And dropped them? The one in battle? Maybe they can lead me to the other soldier. There. Tracks on the missing Tanakh. Now let's follow these tracks. See some blue Definitely smoke. It looks like the other Tanakh ran off this way. There's a lot of supplies Tanakh. they lost. Hey! hey! Vita sent me! By the ten, that lump made it. I thought we were both finished. finished. Let's clear out these machines! Nice try, mister. And critical strike you right in your tail. Bucko. Ow, ow. Whoa, hey, whoa. Stop trying to spray your piss on me, okay? Look. Oh, you're down? Okay, you're dead. See, this is what happens when you try to piss all over Aloy. You die. More machines inbound! More? More? These ones are purple. These are Hephaestus machines. Where'd you go? Where are you at? Nice try, Buck. That's hurting, that's hurting. Hey, that should hurt him too. I'm just saying. Battery, so that's not good. That's not good. Greetings, Alpha. Welcome. 
And as you can see, I'm clearly in the middle of a battle, so I can't chat quite so simply. I apologize, I am not ignoring you guys, I just don't want to die. I think that makes sense, does it not? Good job knocking your friend down. Okay, I'm almost dead. Okay, you're down. And you're down. We've got incoming! What really more? How are we going to take that thing down? What is it? Oh, fuck, one of the Velociraptors. That, yeah, I don't know how we're gonna take that down. Well, I mean, obviously with our weapons. Let me, let me get my, uh, plug to charge this in, and then I'll read up on chat. Oh, I have it plugged into my headphones. I'm stupid. Uh, gotta step over so I don't knock stuff over. While we're reading... Quiet. Sounds like a fun time. Hey, Toko. General Kenobi. Ah, hello there. Uh, someone finally gets... Tokoyami has contributed 48,000 total scales to the Stream Horror Game Challenge. Welcome. Sorry I'm late. I was watching an Ishram loose his shit trying to play Elden Ring. Don't feel bad and don't worry about being late. You are still in the first hour of the stream, so that is not even late, guys. Someone finally gets it. Hey, I've been replying that way off and on, Toko. I just usually don't because I'm, you know, in the middle of trying not to die. I don't like where this cord is trying to wrap around. There we go. That, that's better. Weapon is amazing. We did it. I can't believe I'm alive. Vita! <laughs> you stubborn fool. You haven't let me down yet. Okay, are you done? We got you. You're saved. Cool. Thanks. If you hadn't shown up, I would have been. That's true. You would have been food for the machines. They would have eaten you, torn you apart. Oh, should I not be talking about what happened to your friends? I'm just saying. Uh, this is what happened. with my life on the road. That I believe. It's weird that all the girls have this weird, like, mohawk hairstyle. Me too. Very odd. I mean, I'm not saying it's a bad thing. It's just weird to me. No way we can trek back north to salt fight to get more. Also, their hair looks so nice. Like, it's so fluffy and perfect. I wonder what they use for it. Do they use machine oil? You're making me Probably use machine oil. Thanks, Outlander. Hey, Lily. I drew two new pages for the comic and colored the third one. Okay, I will look into those later, possibly off stream. Because I really like looking at them, but I can't... The problem is, when I do them on stream, I can't dedicate the time I would like to dedicate on stream to them. And on stream, I can't dedicate like a whole section to that. Because I, if there was more people sending in more art, I would. And while I do really like your comic, I think it's just... It's a little unfair to be like, here's fan art, and it's only from one person. And it's just... We're just going to talk about how great this other person is. You know what I mean? Is that echo? Is there some echo? Let here. I'll turn it down. Calm down. Stars will be out soon. Let me know. Uh, let me know if the, you still hear some echo later. I'm gonna keep back to my homework and story writing, so don't lose my bloody uh, fecal material. Ciao. All right. Quiet. Have a good one with that. Uh, oh, I'm not posting them yet. I'm just. I'm going to wait. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah. I mean, if you're. Uh. Tch. Dang. I use up a lot of. Uh, a lot of matte aerials. What is all this over here? Oh. Oh. Oh, that is nice. 
That is a beautiful. Oh yeah. Let me. Can you guys still hear me? Everyone needs to draw more. True. Actually true. I I was really enjoying the fan art when people were sending in stuff every week, and there was stuff I could look at. And there was there was some art in there that I was really having fun looking at. Not just yours. Yours was great, but there were other people too. And then everyone just stopped. And now it just kind of hurts me because it's like, well. What was the point in trying to do a fan art so everybody could show off how they're drawing, good or bad? And I get there were some people who wanted to do, um, from that website, but I, sorry, but it didn't, it didn't feel like art from the soul, you know? When it was just, you just, and it, when you just took parts from a website to make a character, and none of them really were resembling any of the gods that they were to look like. So it really started to annoy me. It didn't look like fan art. It looked like fan recreations, if you know what I mean. Oh, the Sky Tribe has these cool orange stones. It's getting steeper. It's getting cold. Should be getting close to Stonecrest. All right. The sheer uh, sheer side climb. I'm guessing I'm going to have to climb up the mountain a bit. I can't, so I can hear... You can hear the game fine? Can you hear me fine? That's what I need to know. Might as well pick up your materials if you're just going to die for me like that. So thank you. Oh, shoot. We have 19 skill points? Holy squacamole. I think we were going for some fighting stuff. Because, uh... I was liking some of the combos. Uh, and then I was like, maybe I'll get this one too. But... This one will be nice. Is there any other critical strikes we can level up? Let's see the other ones. Uh, do I need anything from Survivalist? That one will be useful. Mm. Increase your weapon stamina limit. Wait, this is for... Oh, this is for Hunter. Uh, do we have anything in Survivalist we want? Gain Valor when hit by enemies. That one would actually be very useful. Health potions require more healing and all potions are faster to consume. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, range attacks deal more damage when you're dangerously wounded. Melee attacks deal more damage. When... Uh, let's see. Can we get anything for machine parts? That would be useful. Uh... Move faster while using heavy weapons. Override machines deal more damage. What is this? Uh, boost your resolve against multiple enemies. Damage chains from one enemy to another within 15 meters and boost knockback power. Oh. Um, hmm. This one would actually be really nice. I think I might upgrade this. This could be a useful ability to have for later. For now, I like our stealth ability, but that'll be a really good one too. I feel like the first Valor abilities are really good. I liked everyone's art too. So what do you remember about my Cure Ranger idea? Uh, the Cure Rangers, I think there was, let's see, there's the Phoenix. Um, there was a Silver Ranger and that's all I really remember from the Rangers. Oh, I remember one was um, a thief at one point, right? Right? 
Was I wrong about that? I'm I'm slowly remembering. What is this? Claw Strider. A fire claw strider. What the heck? A fire breathing velociraptor? Holy fucking hell, that's cool. Oh, whoa, look at all these pieces on here. That looks really cool. This must be Stonecrest. Katara should be waiting for me. But maybe I should look around first. Anything interesting in the area? Hey, let's let's heal you up, buddy. Can can I even heal you? Yeah. There we go. Why does it still show you sparking? Uh, it must not just it just must not change it yet. Right, let's head into Stonecrest. And we got a new campfire. That's good. So now we can teleport here. Hello. Is that the champion from the east I see? Yes, I do. Have... Then I've something to okay. Share. Let's quick save. The gold and silver rangers were thieves. Yes. Yes. Okay, I did remember that. And they killed the first bad guy, I, if I remember correctly, the one who killed another guy's dad. I'd like to help you if I can. Lending you my. They also have the robot. Nothing and the scientist me who was um in fact i should tell you the further west you go the there was a scientist making more of those robots as common enemies and they killed him but he sent the blueprints blueprints to the main villain right thanks for the advice i'll stop by if i'm in the area there's katolo Hello. Hey, hello, Catalo. I'm gonna turn up a notch or two. Let me know if it's um. The scouts from the village tell us that they've been moving machines through here for days. Let me know if there's an echo. Some they ride. Others they herd along, and some they even strip for parts, especially cannons. Path ahead will not be easy. We should get going. My orders are to guide you to the bulwark so that you can speak to Dakota. For all the good it'll do. Not so fast. I'm gonna need a little more than that. Uh, I'll still send art even if you decide not to do more fan art features so you can see how many comics... How my comic ends. Okay. Sounds good. What I really want, though, is that intro paragraph where they make the bet and everything. I want that. If you can give me that, I will read it once a week. It won't necessarily be on Wednesdays, but I will read it once a week. So let's let's learn a bit about Stonecrest, guys. And by the way, is there an echo? You drew that. Oh. What is this place? I want to see it. Stonecrest was built as an outpost back when the clans were still at war. Its purpose was to guard the entrance to the valley, as well as keep watch on what happens below. For now, that means keeping watch on Regal's forces. Do it today, just have to color. 10 out of 10. I, I love that. Soldiers to do more than just look on. For all the good it'll do? What's that supposed to mean? The bulwark has stood unyielding since the birth of our clan. Behind it, Tecote believes himself to be invulnerable. Ah, so it's not about me, it's about him. If he insists on defying Hikaru's orders... An outlander and a maimed marshal aren't going to change his mind. Your chief seems to think differently. And that is the only reason I am still standing here, talking to you. I can understand why he is so bitter. He lost his arm. He has a code. He has a code that he follows. And he's a loyal soldier. What I like is that he's loyal. He's not just being, excuse me, Edward. He's not just being an ass like, Oh, fuck this Outlander. I'm not going to listen to the Chief because uh, I don't like, uh, blah, blah, because I don't like this Outlander. No, he's like, I don't think you'll do much good, but I will still listen to my Chief. Whatever my Chief says, I will do. I drew it today, not going to lie. Hey, 
that's faster than I can draw a comic. So that's already amazing. I want to get back into art. I used to love, but then my mother got sick, uh, turned into a not great person, and I lost my passion. But now I'm going to start uh, again. I'll post my progress on your Discord if that's cool. Dude, do it. Do it. There's a, I, there's a reason I have a whole art channel for Lily to post stuff. And anybody can post anything there. And if you guys want, I can even expand that art channel. Like, I'm not a great artist. I wanted to get back into art. That's why on my TikTok, on my YouTube, I do daily art challenges. That's why I randomly just pick a character from the top of my head and just draw it as best I can. Every time, I can see myself improving little by little. Very, very little changes. Like, one thing I've started doing more of, I've started shading certain areas better. And my arts already look, like, d twice as good as they did when I first started. Like, you see that first Brook one versus today. Today's wasn't great. Yesterday's was a lot better. The thing I need to work on is hands. What makes you so sure to Kote won't listen? Sizing of the body and faces. I'm not great with faces, but sometimes I'm pretty good at it. Nothing but its own rattle. Oh, come on, is that all you've got for me? Takaro said you were from the Sky Clan before becoming a marshal. I need to know what you know. Takote is a petty, vindictive schemer. If he had any guts, he would have gone after Hikaru long ago. But instead. He covets the chieftain from behind the bulwark, biding his time, hoping that his foes will weaken one another. Interesting strategy. Not a terrible one, but not very good either. Is that enough for you? For now? What is the bulwark exactly? What makes the bulwark so impenetrable? It's made of massive boulders, impervious to any frontal assault. No army or machine has ever penetrated it. I am the only thing that can get you inside. If we're done talking, that is. He does not like words. He likes action, which is understandable, but not great. Regala's machines. What do we know about that? Why do you think Regala's forces are driving machines to the valley? We've heard similar reports from across the clan lands. The rebels are gathering machines from the wilds. But whatever control they have over them doesn't seem to last. Hmm. So they herd them into camps. Something else happens there. Something... Something that makes their control permanent. I've been to their camps. You're right. They have equipment that can establish a lasting override. May the ten help us all. But it gets worse. How? We've heard rumors that the rebels are scouting larger machines. Oh, that means they're... yeah. I don't know what kind. The tremor tusks. I don't know how to them. The ones we saw in the trailers. Hmm. This is the one problem with them showing this off in the trailers. Is it's their big set piece to get people invested. You know, the tremor tusk. But now, I'm like, now I know things that are going to happen. And it makes those scenes a little bit less like, oh my god. That, like, if they had just shown tremor tusks and they had not shown the Tanakh riding them. I would be blown out of the water when we get to that moment. You were at the embassy. I was. I'm sorry about the other marshals. And their deaths will not go unpunished. <laughs> You're still healing. I will never heal. But that won't stop me from cracking any skulls that need it. Good thing you're on my side, then. <laughs> I like the way she said that. If you notice the way she said that is she didn't try to force him into accepting his failure or his loss or anything like that. She reminded him that he is still a threat, even to her, even in his weakened state against someone who is considered a champion. She cons still considers him a threat. She's bolstering him up while not talking down to him. That was really well done. If you guys didn't notice that subtle, like that line. Uh, I want to get back to a level where I can draw my D&D &D character. You were at that level before? That is awesome. That is so cool. I've never been able to draw my own D&D &D characters. Because I can never, like... One, I'm not that great at drawing. Every time I've gotten a character draw, uh, character art for a D&D &D character, I found it online. Or I paid someone on Fiverr to do it. Um, the Rangers are Lucky Red, Gar Blue. Yeah, I remember that. I remember all that. Uh, more or less. The... The names and the colors don't really matter to me because whenever you say the names, I'm just going to remember the names more or less. Um, but yeah, thus far it's going well. I've got great pages. 
you guys are just i'm loving this chat right now you guys are talking about working on your passions getting better at art sharing it with me i'm loving this so what's the i was at a level where i could freehand legend of zelda the that west. is cool so when that is freaking have cool to cross paths with Brugala's troops along the way we'll either have to fight i think i know tomorrow's art piece i'm gonna do find a way to sneak past unnoticed neither will be easy never is Let's get this over with. What if we get it started with? What, what if we get it under with, huh? Like can, can I get it under with? On me. That sounds fun. Wait, we're going back? How would you convince Dakota to send his challengers? I wouldn't. <sighs> Come on. To not respect a blade and the strength of the fighter who wields it. What good is anyone who lacks that? Well, lucky for us, we're both good fighters, but let's hope it won't come to that. Hmm. So this whole valley is the Sky Clan's territory? It seems like it is, yes. Yes. The clan has defended it for generations. Well, of course. All clans defend Against their places you. for generations. The other Tanakh clans. Even the Karja, long hmm. ago. If you want a history lesson, talk to the chaplains. Will do. You mean like Charlie? Are these descendants of Charlie Chaplin? Where are we going? What are you doing? Where are we going? Where are we supposed to be going? It says follow Kat Katalo, but he's not going anywhere. Hey! How did I miss that? Okay, come on. It's a lot easier when there's two of us. Did we kill him already? Oh, that was easy. Wait, where are the rest of the animals? I, I, I can't, I'll fight you, I just can't see you. They go. Hello. To hide. Going in. What was that sound? Oh, I guess we were supposed to fight those guys, that's why. I guess they were supposed to spawn a little earlier or something. Uh, let's see. Also, I might say I've got a kiss in one of the new pages. I don't mind kisses. If you if we were like, if, if you thought we hated them, we were just memeing, by the way. Kisses are cute. Revali, ooh, ooh, oh, oh, what's this? I think his AI was bugged. Yeah, it's, I think it's because we were supposed to move a little further, and then they were supposed to attack. Uh, they were supposed to attack us, and then what ended up happening is uh, instead of attacking us, uh, they were just waiting for us to get closer, so he didn't move, and I didn't move, and they didn't move, and we were stuck in a standstill. Why would he, when he has the bulwark? I grew up behind the wall. It's easy to have a false sense of safety there. Makes a lot of sense. Interesting, they're in the Many harshest rebels. climate, but they have the most safety. Take the lead. One, two, three, four. Anyone else? 
Let's go around them. And sneak up. Anything to report? Let's try and uh, sneak attack at least one of these guys. Alright, you're down. Wait, they didn't see that? They didn't see that. You're kidding, right? Wait, hold up. How did I get away with three kills there? How did I get away with three kills there? That should not have happened. Now let's go. Yeah, in a second, I need to collect the materials they have. I'm not wasteful. Look, they have so much here for me to get. Look, look at all that. Uh, after the Christmas stuff, I'll go into how he, uh, the bet got made. It's like someone's subscribing or something, except for they're not. That used to be my subscribe sound. Maybe I'll change it back. I don't know. I'm, I'm thinking about changing some of my stuff you back. The rebels have been moving through here for days. By the time Dakota realizes he's out, I don't know, but be thankful you did. This entire valley might be overrun. I know, right? I, I mean, I am so thankful. I'm just confused. I would welcome that day. To see his pride ruined. Is this the bulwark? Whoa! Look at this place. Here it is, the bulwark. Let me know when you are ready, and I will announce us. Uh, let's go into photo mode. And da -da -da -da. And oops. Let's just get a let's get a let's get a screenshot of that. Uh, but to give you a recap, Sue killed his ex-boyfriend because he was an assassin. Stinger killed his brother because he was also an assassin. And Sho was able to find his father, Soji, and became the Cyan Ranger. Awesome. Okay, I think I, think I got a picture of that. Alright, let's go. Let us in. Let me in. You Let there. me in. A marshal requests an audience with your clan commander. I didn't know there were any marshals left. We defend the path to the mountain, where the wings of the ten shall find us. All right, marshal. I'll send the lift for you. Let us in, let us in, let us out, let us out. <laughs> Dude, this place looks cool. They made it look like a giant monster space. Are those machine parts? When we meet with Takote, I'll do the talking. We'll see how it goes. Uh, so I'm gonna have to do some talking, clearly. This was home. A long time ago. Come on. Soldier, you found me the straw. 
Let us see. I like this place. This place is cool. And I'm guessing I can teleport here now. Or at least I will be able to after the cutscene where we talk and chat. Look at all these armor pieces they have set up on the sides. That's not really what I'd call a wound. More like a dismemberment, but sure. Wound. He's, you know, missing an arm. Well, this is a warm welcome. An outlander and a maimed marshal. A spectacle. You're not wrong. Reminds me of where I grew up. I never decided which was worse. When they shunned me, or when they stopped and stared. Right now. What, did he, what would he prefer? He didn't say. Dang it. We're here for Takote. Let us in. I like how they have those, like, velociraptor horns on their head. Damn, they, they, they really made each character unique in this. Like, even the random ones look very unique. This seems like a lot more of a violent tribe. Or at least more of a we don't trust you outsiders tribe. The Sky Clan's mighty son returns. Bless the tent. Your chief has demanded an immediate dispatch of all challengers to the cool route. We're here to make sure yours haven't gotten lost on their way to the grove. I see. The Golem must have dealt our chief a mighty blow. If he's sending you two as messengers. This one defeated Regala's champion, Grutta, at the embassy. She fought honorably. I had the sense to bar our soldiers from that embassy. Just as I have the sense now to keep our challengers here. If they must fight, then they will fight here. Defending our wall. Our clan. That wall won't protect you. Not from the machines Regala controls. They're already at your doorstep. Is this where we're going to see a tremor task and they're going to break through the and front? And what do you know of the battles of the bulwark as we stood? The blood shed upon stone. I know it wasn't meant to be used as a coward's shield. You were a great warrior once. That was then. Dick. Tell Hakaro. Bringing up his Regardless worst trauma and trying to make him look we bad. We keep our challengers here for as long as we are safe behind the bulwark. And something's going to attack. Oh, never mind. I told you, words are useless with his kind. We're going to have to kill him. It won't be easy with all his men above. Are you even listening? As long as we are safe behind the bulwark, he said. Wait here. I need to get a closer look at that wall. What? Why? Sometimes the best way to negotiate with someone is to use their price against them. Oh, the snow's dampening sounds. I like the way this place is designed. And it's nice and spacious. Kind of reminds me of Mother's Heart. But Mother's Heart was a little more cramped. I feel like they didn't know what. The wall might not be as strong as Dakota. They didn't think you. They knew you weren't going to spend much time there, so they made it pretty small. Whereas this one, we come here, so it's nice and vast. Oh, is this one of the fighting pits? Okay, I'll have to come back here later. Mm hmm. Outlander. What do you have? Yeah, I haven't been able to get any fish. Not yet. I have just the things you need. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fish stew seems interesting. Although, can I... Do I even have any food? Oh, yeah, I have two meat in the middles. Huh. Forget about those. You. Do you have anything interesting for me? Iron thread sh Oh, right, the gauntlets. Uh, what's a bolt blaster? Uh, 
Oh, cool. Damn, they added some a lot of cool weapons. Oh, a new spike thrower. Cool. I'm probably just going to wait till we get to the end and then just get all the good weapons okay. there. Uh, now they have to find Sho's other father, Torin, before something horrible happens. They know where he is. He's just in the prison. That's the entire planet. If there's any color inconsistency between pages, I'm sorry. Don't feel sorry about that. It happens to us all. Beaten already, Outlander. Get a little distance from the wall in order to scan it properly. Okay, time to scan the wall. Hmm. <sighs> Just what I thought. There's something metal in there. Oh, that rock is interfering with the scan. I need to get closer. Alright, let's get closer to it then. And we might be able to find a way to let me in! I'm on Horizon Forbidden West, right? This looks like a good way up. Water coming from. All right, now we climb. Why are you going to the right? I'm, why are you going to the right? I'm pressing up. It's because I was angled weird, wasn't it? Flowing into the wall. That's a power point. Looks here might give way. I Someone just them. conveniently left a chest for me here. Thank you. Now, better scan that tank again. Power core. I'll bet if I blew it up. But how? Well, can't do anything else here. Better go find Catalo. All right, let's get out of here. Catalo, I found some answers. I don't know if you'll like them. The guard said you've been scurrying around the wall like a rat. There's some truth to this. What in the name of the town have you been up to? Takote said he wouldn't send his challengers as long as they're safe behind the bulwark. Right? Oh, don't remind me. So? We take it down. Did you hit your head on the way down here? I'm serious. There's something from the old world stuck in there, and it has a power cell. I could blow it up if I just penetrate the first layer of rock and Even metal. Even if what you're saying is true, it would take a cannon to do that. You're right. And you said the rebels were stripping them off machines back in the valley. Come on. No. I'm not getting dragged further into this madness. Hikaru ordered you to help me. You gonna defy him like that arrogant shit up there? Damn, she's swearing now. She has grown quite a bit. She's like, fuck this guy. Fuck him. That was an unkind comparison. <laughs> I love him. He's like, that was mean. I don't like that. I don't like you. Hurt my the rebels might have made camp northeast of here. And then what? The two of us go up against all of them? Pretty much, yeah. Oh, you may lack sense. I don't lack courage. No, I do so, not. So, um, back there with Dakota? It seemed like there's bad blood between Are they two. brothers? There is. If we make it through this plan of yours, perhaps I'll tell you. Hmm, cool. We get some more lore oh, bits. Well, it looks like the rebels just got a lot more firepower. Yep. Ready? Tremor Tusk. Move up! This 
is our first Tremor Tusk in the game, too. on the others. I'll follow you in. Maybe I should see if there's anything I can use to take that thing down. My focus can help. Load up, squad. Soon we march. Hmm. <clears throat> Rebel Tremor Trust. They're weak against frost. Good to know. Strong against fire. And I struck a blood flow now. Okay, I have plenty of healing materials. Looks like he's armored, so I can't kill him in one shot. Anyone else? What is that triangle over there? Oh, it's just a rock. Interesting rock formation. Usually triangles in this game mean some sort of uh, old world tech. Wait here. How's your day? Well, I lost my post frostbite. Thanks for asking. Hmm. There's some more chill water. Need the right kind of ammo to detonate that. Where'd that other person go? Okay. I hate Paddy Power games. What do you mean Paddy Power games? Explain. I actually really love, really love doing the coloring. Oh, that's awesome. I love all the snow. I'm almost done with all. Yay! I can't wait. Too late for you. I can get up there. Good to know. Identify yourself. You're in over here. They're down. Looks like it's time. Holy, these things have lots of cannons. Oh god, this battle needs to go. Ah! I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, okay. Not stuck anymore, not stuck anymore. Yeah, 
Whoa. It one shot at me. Damn. Okay, that hurt. Okay, okay. We need to. Uh, I hate E2 that tried to rip me off. That's why I switched to Virgin Mobile. I'm very confused, Alpha. What are you talking about? What is EE? -E? I don't know what Virgin Mobile is. That's the cell phone provider. Or not cell phone provider. Uh, telecommunications company. see me you don't you don't see me I'm invisible I am in the grass see it's all cool it's all good it's chill we're chill we're chill it's all cool we're chill we're good we're chill You can't, but you will. So, you know, it's kind of the way it is. Sorry, not sorry. God, these things hurt! Oh, God. you yeah, you are going down this is a lot harder when I have to fight a machine and people. I love this battle music though. God, this really is, this hurts, this hurts. Never mind, I'm too exposed, I'm too exposed, too exposed, too exposed. Bad idea, bad idea. I don't really, let's be honest, uh, I'm not a huge fan. Look, 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 look. 
Let's be cool about this. Let's be cool. Let's be cool. Let's be cool. Okay, never mind. Let's not be cool. <laughs> ah, you fell for my trap. You fell for my trap card. Okay, let's get around. Uh, see if we can bait him with the chill water. Dang it. God, this thing is so big. Heal, heal, heal. Thank you. Let's eat that meat in the middle. Freeze this thing. There we go, got it. Took it down. Might as well pick up some chill water while we're... Where, where are you? Oh, there you are. Got them all. So, about that cannon. First, let's collect your materials. And a free cannon. Well done. Me and Virgin Mobile are phone networks providers in the UK. Oh, that makes work. more sense. Here. I may be maimed, but I've still got a strong back. Damn, that guy is buff. Fucking Tanoth warrior's buffness. After you. Yeah, let me just collect some more chill water. I used up quite a bit during that battle. Let's collect medicine hey. while we're on the way. You fought well back there. I did not think we'd survive. But killing the rebels and the machine. It was good to take the fight to them for once. That is the way Even of the Aloys. We do not sit and cower. Aloys go straight forward oh, no, and else. stabby stab. We stabby stab. And then and then we uh we machine machine. See, I am smart smart. So I use tactic, tactic, to make problem, problem for enemy, enemy. Why are you doubling your words? I don't know. Why are you doubling your words? Okay, get off my back. Uh, you can't see me, and his name was John Cena. Uh, seems quieter when it snows. The ads, too many ads. What am I supposed to do? Turn to the bulwark. Here it is. But you don't just need a cannon. You need a miracle. Coming right up. Well, go on. Okay. Gonna blast away some rocks. We can expose the power cell. It's working. Not get it, Adam. This isn't gonna work. Well, isn't this impressive? Two children playing siege. I hope they haven't hurt the bulwark's feelings. Come now, stop embarrassing yourselves. 
and leave this poor mountain alone. This is your last chance, Takote. You can still Damn, I love this carrot and stick. We gave you the carrot. Chance. Now it's you time for the stick. Leave this place, Savage, now, and take this cripple with you. All right then. Here's the stick. If you had listened to the carrot, this wouldn't have happened. Say goodbye to the bulwark, you fools. What have you done? Can't hide behind the wall anymore, Takote. Now you have to join Hikaro. Never. Never. We will. We will rebuild it. Immediately. Okay. You are not safe. The bulwark couldn't protect you from a single cannon, let alone an army of machines. The only pathway to safety is to unite against Regala with your chief. Now become a man and stand up. Stop cowering like a child. While the clan remains safe behind the bulwark. So send them now. Unless. Your word means nothing. Send them. I didn't hear you. Send the challengers. I look forward to seeing the Sky Clan's colors in the arena. Well done. I love this guy. I love how even crippled he has not lost his honor or his inner strength. And I thanks to Aloy, Marshall. he has got he has learned to regain it. What's gonna happen to this place? But that's better than living apart from the tribe, as pawns in Takote's foolish schemes. If you want to check up on them, talk to Jera, the chaplain of the clan. If anyone needs help up there, she'll know. Yeah. Oh, good. More side missions for me to do. I'll take my leave then. Crazy lad. Need to report to <laughs> Wait, how come I didn't play? Good. Let's see it. It should have played. That's annoying. I'll have to... That... I don't know. I think this new... There was a new update to OBS, and now things are acting strange. So I need to fix that. Mine, I need to fix trigger fire, and I need to fix something else. Trigger fire should have activated the crazy laugh. I didn't even hear it. Might also be a good idea to resupply before I head back out. Oh, we got a new face paint to knock the conqueror. Can we climb this to get up there now? Yes, we can. <laughs> the game, they knew. They knew you wouldn't want to keep taking the elevator. What is this? Machine strike. Oh, their board game. Oh, is that what the last type of quest is? Yeah, the, these ones, it's Machine Strike. We should go back to Chain Scrape and try Machine Strike. I'm not great at chess, but I can do it. Let's see what these question marks are first. I like to have all the stuff on the map exposed. This reminds me of um, the Frozen Wilds expansion. Looks like it's up there. How doth I get up there? My brother will make it. Looks like this is the way up. Okay, let's take the stars. It played for you. Okay, well if it plays for you, that's all that matters. It sucks that it doesn't play for me. So at least you didn't waste it. I'm gonna. I'm thinking of setting up a new system for over the weekend. You made a big impact at the bull. Well, yeah, I destroyed a part of it. I don't know how to make a bigger impact than that. The commander doesn't want to be scorched. Fine. Where's this question mark? It, 
is it this way? If we want to reclaim our honor, then we must do so in battle. It looks like it is. Alright. What is over here? Honor and strength. Hey, oh, a cooker. Oh no, they're a weaver. Ooh. This looks like a cool outfit. To knock the Vindicator. Plated desert clan armor traditionally worn by high ranking raiders. Augmented to exploit elemental feet effects. Uh, what do I need from this? Oh, Crimson Bloom. I kind of like the color of this one better. Oh, is this just a dire? I thought it was a wheat, a stitcher. I mean, I'm sad now. Oh, this is the face paint people. So wait, what is this? This is um. This is the dire. Okay. You there? Come and trade. Can I get a cool die for my main outfit? I like the colors, but I like the base one too. Return to me another time. Uh, okay, let's see what these side quests are. Uh, let's see. Someone said something about their brother. Look, I just don't know why he thought going. Up What's going on here? The Lawbreaker. I guess that's a new Jack title brother I have. Here went off to get himself killed. He'll finish the climb. I know it. <laughs> Not likely. My brother Pento left to climb the March of the Ten to get his soldier's mark. It was supposed to be done by now, but he's not back yet. They're probably attacked by machines. Ataka, to your training now. Your brother should have stuck to his cleaning duties. I hear my cat. Let Would me get my kitty real mind quick. Mind checking up on the march? If I leave, my squad leader will kick my ass. What? And I don't want anyone thinking I'm worried about my brother making the climb. Because I'm not. I get it. You can't miss the path markers. They're by the waterfall west of here. If I head that way, I'll see what's going on. Thank you. No slacking, soldier! Oh, come here, baby. I'm coming, I'm coming. Look, we got the nightshade kitty. She wanted to say hi. Hi, it's me, nightshade. I'm a kitty. I want to say hi to everyone because I'm so pretty. I'm a pretty kitty, pretty kitty. I'm a pretty, pretty, pretty kitty. Yeah, I love the hugs and I love the pets. I'm a kitty who, lo who can't go to the vet. Alright, let's see what other quests what other quests are there for me, yeah? What else can we learn from the quests? You quest over here. Upstairs. Oh, I pass you before and I not take except quests. This is me by fault. The wall is not break uh, say I am the wall breaker. Breaker of walls. Can I ask what you're arguing about? Oh, Sariva won't let it rest. She insists. They have a lot of women in this tribe. That's cool. on the wings of the ten. But I say, hanging on to a stormbird for dear life isn't the same. A Tanakh rode a stormbird? She went up in the air. But road is a strong word. Ha! Huh, you admit it. You're talking about her like she's no longer around. She's not. After she grabbed onto the machine, Ku offered her to that mountaintop. The Stormbird still circles the peak. We never saw Farika again. It's sad. What a way to go. I'll say. It's a shame no one can reach that mountain. Well, she hey! She's a great uh. soldier with armor to match, and it serves no one lying up there. I'm a there's a plate you can take right over there. No doubt. But unless you want to try what Farika did, there's no realistic way to get up there. For now. Telling you she flew. Still doesn't count. I wanna I wanna see the 
Yes, I want to see this last quest. We'll pick up some side quests here, and then we're going to go back to Chain Scrape, try um, that one chess game. Uh, no, I'm good. Don't want to trade anything right now. We can do that later. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good. Can you fell as easily as Are you Chaplain Jera? Catalo said I should talk to you to see if you need help. Bold move, wall breaker. Burying Takate's pride beneath the bulwarks. <laughs> I like the way you said that. Uh, I was just at ease. Many in the clan agree with you, and Marshal Catalo was right to send you to me. There is something you can help with. Yes, what is it? A few of our soldiers followed him to the embassy at Baron Light against Takote's orders. Right. I remember Catalo showed up last with only a few representatives from the Sky Clan. When those soldiers returned home to Kote, we assigned them to an old watchtower, one we had abandoned to the machines. Mm. Sounds like a death, uh, that with war a suicide doing, mission, it must really. Be reclaimed, but those soldiers are serving no one out there. So bring them back. If, however, they were to return by request of Hakaro's champion, Takote wouldn't have the backing to deny them, <laughs> especially when their chaplain supports their return. That makes a lot of sense. So we're gonna Thank just bring soldiers some soldiers back. Sounds good. Easy. Guard. Simple. Sounds easy enough. Go to the cold rushes, a long stretch to the west. The watchtower stands beside the falls. Speak to Kiva there, the squad's leader. Good luck. Alright, uh... Oops, not what I want to do. We have two new side missions. So, uh, this is the... Uh, until tonight. What is this one? Oh, the first to fly one. Yeah, 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 I can't do that one yet. Squad of Shadows is going to change the old watchtower. Here, yeah, let's go talk to the cook in Sulfite. See if we can do that mission. And we'll uh, fast travel there, because I think we've been to Sulfite once already. Yes, we have. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's where we did the thingamajig. The, the, uh, you know what it was. What are they called? Just finished dinner. It was delicious. Oh, I'm glad. What'd you have, Lily? Torn and the other prisoners are forced to mine an area where there's supposed to be a Kyo globe, and the warden wants to use it to upgrade the Vice Shogun, which is the highest level of authority besides Don Homage. Interesting. That is spoopy AF. I don't want them being upgraded at all. I'd rather them stay nice and weak for me, if you don't mind. Ah, the dyers. Find me some fresh ones. Red hair. Keen eye. Big spear. Yes. Those ingredients mean a Nora warrior. Aloy, right? News travels fast across the desert. There's not a rumor in the land that doesn't cross the cook pot. Kitchens chop up the meat and stir in the gossip. <laughs> I like the way you put that. that not not untrue. Gossip. Very accurate. I might well, use that line later. That can make her stronger. You think soldiers are the only ones with skills? Blades aren't just for That is war. a Sanji line if I ever Slice heard one. up the right ingredients and you'll be stronger in the field. With the correct preparation. And what do you need from me? Clear from doesn't seem convinced by your claims. The people here would stick their heads in the ground and drill out their dinners like grazers if they could. But I'm convinced if I show Hakata here, if I show any of them the benefits, then the others will come around. You know, that makes a lot of sense. I'm not saying you're wrong. This meal can make me stronger? Stronger, healthier, more resistant. There are all sorts of benefits depending on how I prepare it. You vary your diet, you benefit from the different properties. I feel like I'm almost never going to use these food Look benefits. The awesome. I mean, I used one once. They and drink that was all it. that beer and come out barrel shaped. So, why is it so hard to believe that food could change you in other ways? I mean, that makes sense. You're not incorrect. What else are you selling? Dining delights, tastes of heaven, and meals to make a warrior. A better warrior of you. What do you have? Salted lizard bites, shaved salted haunch, spike stalk stew. Hmm. 
Mm, boost machine damage, minus two levels for three minutes. I think that's damage two machines, right? Oh, never mind. Valor Surge Master by two. Hmm, interesting. Okay. What ingredients do you need? Some bird meat and a little mystery ingredient. If it stays a mystery, I won't be able to get it for you. Wild bird's eggs. These soldiers won't touch them. They claim warriors only. Well, eggs kind of are meat, but, but not exactly. A true warrior takes every advantage. I'll get you those ingredients. See, Hakata? True soldiers aren't cowards in the Oof. kitchen. Well, that's one you way to put it. You can get the eggs from the island in Desert's Tier. The lake just outside the walls. As for the meat, plenty of birds feed in the grasses around the shores. Bring the ingredients back here, and you'll get that meal for free. Sounds like a plan. I like it. Okay, so I gotta go up there and over across. That's not too bad. It's kind of scary that there are fire glint hawks now. I'm just saying. Uh, this way then. Come, trade. This will break my fall. Really, your fall wasn't too bad. I just like using it, so don't don't feel like I'm doing it because we're injured. Not even close. Wait, am I going the wrong way? I'm so confused. You know, let's go this way. Just go straight across. Let's go straight across. Oh, some machines out here. Nice. Looks like we've already stripped them for parts. Unfortunate. Oh, there are seagulls now. Cool. Oh, look at how that looks. That looks beautiful under the water. This is my favorite part that they added, is that there's now aquatic exploration. There was not much of it in the previous game, but now we can actually go underwater, which is there amazing. There should be goose on this island, if I can find the nests. Nests are probably up high. Er, what? Aloy, why are you not... Okay, so you're going to be annoying. A wide maw is one way to protect your nest. That's one. Green churn for something special. I thought I saw a ping. Oh, it's under the water. Oh, there's green shine under the water. Okay, good to know. Thank you. Could try my focus, see what it picks up. sniper buff. Don't really need to be, but oh well. That's another egg. Meal along the bottoms here does not look like it. Ah, it saw me. Doesn't 
know I'm here. Doesn't know I'm here. Ooh, I got goose feathers for my uh, resource pouch, which is nice. Could the rest of the eggs be? I found. Are you around this mountain? Oh yes. Got one. Okay, so now I just need to find one more. Could look around with my focus. Thank you. That's the bird meat. Now I just need the eggs. I just need the last egg. Where could the last eggs be? There goes a nest on that smaller island. Oh, over there. What's this swim across? Actually, we can just... Okay, okay, ooh. I think we got it. I think we're gonna find... We just, thank you. And then a glint hawk just comes from down here above. Ooh, treasure. Here it is. That's all the eggs. And we found them Time all. Time to get back to Salt Bite. Oh, we can kill the white moth? I didn't even see that as an option. Yeah, there's no point in killing the white moth. We should go the opposite way, because that will actually be kind of faster. Um, most of the arc is focused on Torn and how he deals with his prison and secretly communicates with the Q Rangers to find a way to, out of the prison along with the Q Globe so the warden can't use it. Wow, that's messed up. That warden worked hard for his whole life to get that one globe and now you're just taking it from him. You're just going to take, take, take and never give. What are you? You a, you a thief? You a thief? Why is that goose not trying to fly away or bite me. That is interesting. Look at the kitty. Oh, she wants just pet it. She wants the kitty scratches. Yeah, you love the ear scratches. She's such a good girl. Except for yesterday when you were running around where you're not supposed to be. That was bad girl. Bad kitty girl. Salt bit. Salt bit. We're gonna get some salt and go. Uh, let's do the workbench thing real quick. Loading. Thank you. Uh... Might as well. We have we have the shards and the materials. Uh, right. We should upgrade this because we haven't upgraded it yet. Make our sharpshooter bow a little bit better. And this last one will just give us a new slot, but we're probably not going to use that. Come and trade. Nah, I'm good. Just want to do my mission. 
He's part of an evil space emperor that has conquered most of the universe, so he kind of just, no, he worked hard to work his way up in an evil empire, and now we're just going to steal from him? What is this? What are we? What are we? Thieves? We're thieves, aren't we? We're the worst kind of thieves. We're thieves who think we're good. This is, this is outlandish. May the courage of your stomach bring you victory in battle. We'll be here whenever you desire more delicacies. And your next meal will be on the house. So, Hakata. All right. All right. If that Nora will risk the chef special, I will. Again, it's going off. Didn't do nothing. Just decided to be like, it's time to play this song. <laughs> yeah, let's try this one one more time. Because I want Quiet. to end this. If that's and then, uh, you know, we'll, we'll do some other stuff. Other, other, not so... Wine sickens me. It's your whining that turns stomachs around here, Hakata. But this meal will put that right. Uh... Hmm. Cook's right. Those meals could give me an advantage. Maybe I should pick some up before I go. I will, but, you know, it's all the way... I got It's all the way over there. The leader wants to you destroy the universe, so I think he deserves it. Well, if he worked hard to destroy the universe, he deserves to destroy the universe. Damn it. I'm just, you know, look. You're taking the hard works of a tough man and turning them into some sort of villainous thing. When we all know that really what this is about, it's about the cheese. They took all your cheese and now you're, you're mad. But look. If you could protect your cheese, did you really deserve it? Huh? Soldier? Is it saying I never saw a frost fellow back? Probably because I never killed one. Let's wait for it to turn around, and then we're just going to throw this spike into its back. Okay, you know what? Fuck it. Easier to kill that way. What do I need? The Bellavac Circular. I guess I need to shoot it off from the bottom. Fire could hurry it. Fine gullet. How do I get the circular? What is this shit? Looks like a lance wound, but with scarier antlers. Yeah, it looks like they, I can't get the whatever. Ow, 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 ow. Rude, rude, rude. I'm just... Look, we're having a gentleman's duel here. Now, what part of gentlemen's duel do you not understand? God.
Oh, I got a circulator. Finally. Holy, that took way too long. Now I wanted to trade for one damn weapon. One dang diddly darn dished weapon. But no, the game's like, you can't have that. You're not allowed. Spy, crunchy spike stuff. Come on, Velo. Move it. Velos, let's go. Rawr, rawr. Let's find a, let's go to another uh, campsite. Last episode's arc, they were able to break into the prison. Torn was able to find the Q Glove and turn into the Phoenix Soldier and killed the Warden. Then uh, Don Armage himself shows up and tries to fight the Rangers, and all twelve were able to kill him. That sounds short. What signal? There's a signal. Yeah, you. I could use your insights later on. All right, what do you want to tell me? One of our scouts found some ancient ruins southwest. Well, thanks for letting me know. Had a look for myself, but came out empty-handed. I can't shake the feeling we missed something. Oh well. Must be my disappointment talking. What about your, uh, Maybe I'll have better just appointment? Time. Is your appointment talking? We can always check out the ruins. Now we can get this quest off our backs. Thank heavens. Because that was getting annoying. Uh, okay, where are you? Here, let's trade. Now that is a purchase you won't regret. Oh damn, this is a really nice trip caster. Purge water canister. Oh shit, nice. This is nice. It was a great trip caster. I'm glad we did all the work to get that. Wait, you had, you could have had the parts right here. You had this just hanging out, but you didn't want to, you don't want to use the parts. You know, I did all that work. I should, I should spear you right now. Someone is hosting a party in the dragon's den. You work for me. You got the parts right there. I could just give you the money. Let me give you the money. I have so much money. Look at all my money. I have, actually, I'm not sure how much I have. Four thousand? Four thousand? You wouldn't accept four thousand? Okay. 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 I see how it is. I see how it is. Uh, I want to move faster with heavies. That, that'll be useful. This will be useful if we ever end up fighting against, like, a giant machine. Moon! Hi, Moon! Oh, my God! Thank you for riding with the par- Moon, you're raiding with the party of six? Oh, my God. Welcome, everyone. Welcome to the Dragon's Den. If this is your first time here, I am the- I am your host, the one, the only, ZA Single Gaard. I, uh, stream every Monday, Thursday, and Friday at 3 p.m. PST, and on Wednesdays, I stream with my friend, the Mythology Guy, at 3.30 I hope you all enjoy it here. Uh, right now, we do have a community challenge going on where if you get the channel points, which we call Dragon Scales here, you can get me to play a horror game and I will scream like a little baby on camera. I will. I am such a screamer. You have no idea. Thank you so much, Moon. Thank you. Oh, where's my jacket? Oh, it's right here. Guys, guys, those of you who don't know Moon, uh, she makes amazing jackets like this one. 
It's one of my, it, it, this is my favorite jacket of all time, and I love it. I always have it in every stream on my, uh, on my chair here behind me. I'm not, I'm not, I don't usually wear it because it gets really hot in here really quick. Like, this room is really tiny, and this is such a good jacket at just keeping you warm. I wear this jacket when I go out in the middle of winter, by the way, and it keeps me warm the whole time. The only problem is I get worried about ruining the horns, but other than that, I love this jacket. So go check Moon's Etsy out. Let's go. So can somebody shout out uh, Rising Moon for me? Uh, is any of my are any of my mods here? Here, let me do it real quick. I'll shout out Rising Moon. There we go. Yeah, go check her out. I appreciate you, and I'm so glad you love the jacket. I yeah, I I love this. I remember I just happened to see your stall at um at TwitchCon, I think it was, like, three years ago. And I was like, oh, should I get it? Should I get it? Because, you know, obviously you need to be paid for your efforts. I'm just going to put this back on my back on my chair here. Ah. There we go. That's the way I have it. Uh, so you can see the horns while I sit here in my throne. I uh, Yeah, I do love the jacket. It is literally my favorite jacket. I, if I could wear it all day, I would. But I, A, don't want it to get dirty. And B, don't want it to get ruined ever. And C, like I said, this room is really... It's not... Okay, this room is actually pretty big. But I have a lot of stuff in here. And when I'm streaming, my um, I have my lights on, which create heat. My fan for my computer. And then a fan for my PS5 and my TV. Heat this room up so much. Like, you have no idea. Well, it's, it's, not, it's not super bad. It's not like... It's not like uh, summers in Texas bad. But it just gets really warm. Seriously, guys, go check out uh, Moon. She is so much fun. She is super chill. She's usually playing a lot of Genshin right now. And if you're not into Genshin, that's okay because she is just fun to talk to about stuff. She'll just she'll talk to you about anything. Uh, we have, let's see. Um, all right, we were going to go to um, whatchamacallit. All the way back to chain scrape. I wanted to check out this. We didn't do that. We didn't do that. We were supposed to do that, and then we never did. Typical Zaggard. Let's just go find their um their fireplace. Where is your fireplace, friends? There's a traitor. Uh, I had to come from this direction. So your fireplace is in this direction. Did I pass it? Am I, am I blind? Oh, it's up here. That's why. Oh, it's a giant fire. Never mind. No, it's not. Lol. Okay, let's head back here. How's Horizon treating me? Oh, it is so much fun. I freaking loved the first game. It was my favorite game of 2017. That's the same year uh, Le uh, The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild came out. Got my own a cat got my tongue oh do you want to see my kitty moon do you want to see my kitty just just say yes or no if you want to see the kitty. or just you know i mean obviously you know you know how to you know how to type in english uh but yeah it was my favorite game of all of all of 2017 even and breath of the wild came out that year and i am a huge breath of the wild fan like if you saw my all my um uh, i have every single legend of zelda amiibo they've ever made uh but I loved Horizon so much, and I've been waiting for this game so much. So I'm glad I get to play it. Let's try out Machine Strike. That was a smile. In some strike, sister? Let me set the board. I was just passing by. I... Mm, Cat? Okay. Timer, huh? Come here, Nightshade. You little sleepy you kitty. Oh. Uh, oh, this is Nightshade. Well, aren't you in luck, then? I got an extra set. A Tanakh original this straight is, out of the uh, Nightshade? West. For those of you who don't know, she's my toothless kitty. She literally has no teeth. She's just a cute little fluffer kitty who has no teeth, but she loves to play, so she'll always try and bite you and play with you. She is such a good girl. She loves being held. See, look, she's trying to bite me. Here, let's see if I can get her to bite me while I'm holding her. Come on, come on, come on. No, she's just getting annoyed. Sorry, kitty. Oh, she's such a good girl. Mm, I love you. I love you too. She's purring a little bit. She loves attention and people. 
and she loves to play. I wish I could. Here, let's. You can kind of see her in the corner. She's trying to play with me. Yeah. Oh. Ah. Yeah, she's. Uh, yeah, she's a tortie. I think you're the one who told me that she's called a tortie. Um. She has a tortie tude. Is that a type of thing? I'm gonna have to have dinner. See you in a bit. All right, Toko. Have fun with your dinner. Let me know what you ate and if you enjoyed it. Again, so seriously, Moon, thank you for the raid. It means so much. It really does. From the bottom of my heart. Like, I love whenever a fellow streamer raids me or hosts me or anything. So thank you. I actually saw you in Discord earlier. In your Discord. And I was going to... Um, I was like, oh, this is the voice comms for subs. Maybe I should join it. But then I was like, I have to do work. So I, I decided not to. I have a Tori too. She bites and gnaws on me to play. Yeah, that's how Nightshade is, but she has no teeth, so it's just fun. But let's try, you know, let's let's see if we can play this game. All right, let's start off simple. The Tanakh like to say that Machine Strike is a game of pure strategy, pure strategy. like chef. We each get a set of pieces. Each piece represents a kind of machine. Oh, that's cool. And each machine is worth a different number of victory points. Okay. And to win the game, you'll need to gain seven victory points by destroying the opponent's machine. All right, makes sense. It can be tricky remembering the details of every machine, so we use these notes to keep track of them. You see that number on the top right corner? Oh, uh, that's how much it takes to kill it. Got it. That there is how many victory points you'll get for destroying that machine. Oh, those are victory points, not HP. Notes also tell you how far a piece can move. Okay, so that's movement. That's attack. How powerful their attacks are. Oh, the heart is the HP on the bottom right. I didn't see that before. The distance they can strike from. Okay, so it's a melee. And, of course, their health. Okay, that's enough for now. Let's just play. I'll explain the rest as we come. I want this to be an actual board I game. I would board, play this. So I get to choose who goes first. Since this is your first time, I'll let you go. Usually you get to choose which pieces to set on the board, but this will do for now. Pick up that machine piece to your right mm -hmm. and move it forward. And remember, each machine can only move a certain... Take a look at your notes if you need a reminder. Easy enough, huh? Now, you get to move two machines each Okay, round. that makes sense. So go ahead and pick a second machine. Let's move Just it over need there. To, um, move that machine forward, Red. I guess we have to move it forward. Perfect. There's not much else to Overcharge do for now, so Just end your turn. Hmm. We're forging onwards. Let me move my Have you played the new Horizon game yet, Rising? Rising Moon, Moon, Moon of the Rise. And we're back to you. This time, why don't you try attacking one of my pieces? Try with that machine on your right first. Okay. Now move the when performing an attack, you'll be testing your machine's combat power against the opponent's. A machine's combat power is a combination of the terrain your machine is standing on and its own attack power. Okay. This board only has grassland terrain, which has no effect on a machine's combat power. Good to know. And your current machine has two points of attack power. So in total, your machine's combat power equals two points. Since my machine isn't the one attacking, it has zero points of attack power. And just like your machine, it's not affected by grassland terrain. Makes sense. So right now, the difference in combat power between the two machines is two points. This means your machine can do two points of damage to my machine. Did you get all that? I got it. Uh, yeah, let's keep going. So no, not yet. I've been too engrossed in Genshin and sewing again. Well, I'm glad that you're engrossed in the sewing because your your stuff that you do in sewing is beautiful, and I'm glad you're enjoying Genshin. Because I I I'm glad. I'm always happy when other people can enjoy things. See how your machine can't move close enough to attack mine? You can make your machine sprint. That lets it move one space further. Try it out. Okay. Downside to sprinting is that your machine can no longer attack. Now, some players like to take a risk and overcharge their machine in cases like this. 
I would rather say Overcharging lets you attack after a sprint, but it will damage your machine's health by two points. So use at your own discretion. Nah. Let's try doing that now. Just overcharge your machine. Oh, I guess I have to. That's about it for your Okay, let's see what you do. You just giving me the round? I'll let you in on a neat trick. That machine of yours, the one closest to me, grab a hold of it. Mm-hmm. Same as in the wilds. Machines have both armored points and weak points. Front is the armored, back you is the weak, I'm guessing. On the pieces. Blue shows where their armor is thickest. Yep, okay. Hit them there, and you'll do some damage, but not a lot. Now, red shows the machine's weak points. Hit those, and you'll deal a mighty blow. Here, let me show you. Rotate that piece so your machine faces mine. Now let that machine have it. Off the board she goes, and there's your first victory point. Th thank you. You don't have seven of them yet, so let's keep going. Well, I can only get two. Your machine two. attacked mine, but hasn't moved yet. Go ahead and move downwards towards my remaining piece. You've already attacked a machine and moved your piece. But if you overcharge your machine, and by the look of your machine, you'd be sacrificing your piece to defeat my. But sometimes that can be overcharged. Yeah, got it. So if I overcharge it, it'll sacrifice, and through? I'll get the point, but no. I'll, it'll kill my because machine. Because your machine was knocked out at the same time as mine, we both get the victory points our machines are worth. Good news is, since you're the one attacking, you're going to receive your victory points before I do. So I would win. Which means you can reach the coveted seven victory points first. Got it. That's why sometimes losing a piece can be the best way to end a game in your favor. Now, you'll notice you didn't get quite up to seven victory points this time. But you did destroy all my pieces. That means... You're the winner. I guess that's one way of putting it. Sure, it thanks. So hard, was it? I'm going to lurk now. Got to take care of the hubby who isn't feeling well. Oh, I'm sorry about that. Well, thanks again for stopping by. I, I've already had a great stream just because you stopped by Rising Moon. And for everybody else who's here, thank you for joining us here in the Dragons. And I hope you click that follow button so we can see you in future streams. We love talking about everything here. We talk about games, anime, TV show, movies, food, clothing. It's a small set to be sure, but language. The only thing we don't really like talking about here much is politics and stuff like that. But that's just because that stuff always gets, you know, icky. They've got all kinds of unique pieces that can turn a game in your favor. Though they'll need the right materials to craft you one. Or you might find them in the wilds if you're lucky. You know, I've lost my fair share of pieces after a night of machine hunting or brew hopping. No need to thank me. Always a pleasure to help out new strike players. Now, if you feel like playing a real game, I've got plenty of other boards. I could even teach you a few more tricks if you're up for it. Maybe some other time. Thanks. I'll think about it. Okay, so we understand the basic game. Got it. Uh... We'll do one of these later. Come back anytime, Red. Is this the new types of quests we have? No, it's not. Oh, I'm evaded. What are these last types of quests? What is that last category? All right, let's go do this side mission. But while we do this, before we do the side mission, guys, I have to go make myself something to eat because I'm getting really hungry. We'll be right back. After the... You ever Tired. felt like nothing in your Mr. life is Disney? solid? Have you ever Have felt, you ever felt like, like you your life is crumbling apart? Massive then try Earth. Then try Earth water. is a tool created by water the best manufacturers in the world the to help keep it's your life stable. And delicious. Earth is a great tool that can be sugar, used in a multitude of ways. Syrup, it can be used to build your house on, for planting water trees, and even growing food. Earth is not for amateurs. If you plan on using Earth without the proper knowledge, please make sure you bring along an expert in the field to help you use Earth to its fullest potential. When used incorrectly, 
Earth can cause avalanches, lion slides, earthquakes, sinkholes, and volcanic eruptions. Earth should not be used around small children or infants. If any small children or infants are involved in an earth accident, please call your local rescue services. Please Do not sure try and solve the problem yourself. Remember, certified. Earth is there to keep you stable on Man, your feet. Water is good. Earth, stay grounded. Water, have a sip. Tired, confused, or dizzy? Have you ever felt like you just can't go on because of massive headaches? Then try water! Water is the newest soft drink on the market. It's refreshing and delicious, all while containing zero sugar, zero corn syrup, and zero calories. Water will give you the strength to complete the toughest of tasks on the hottest of days. Water can even be used for cleaning yourself and your clothes. An overexposure to water can lead to flooding, massive downpours, tsunamis, whirlpools, and even drowning. Gnarly, dudes. If this happens to you, call 911 and some bros will be there in a flash. If you're planning to use water without an experienced physician around, please make sure you bring along someone who is CPR certified. Man, water is good. Water, have a sip.
All right, chat, we are back, and we are going to go... <clears throat> uh, we're going to go help... Dude, where is it? Uh, is this the way out? No, this isn't the way out. Those are the cook fires. You don't know which direction I'm supposed to be heading, do you? Well, good news for you is neither do I. So, uh... There we go. This is the way out. Welcome. Goodbye. Well, now... Let's go take the um, the fires and teleport all the way. Damn, that is far. Um, really far. Okay. Uh, what is this? A black box. Oh, there's a black box. Cool. This is still locked, isn't it? Okay, I'm gonna. I have to find a way to turn this off, because this is starting to really bug me. I'll find a way to turn this off later. For now, we'll just leave it upside down, so the sound doesn't come out as much. Because the speaker's on the top of it. Uh, what is there? What is this? Oh, it was right, that, uh, that one gate that was destroyed. Mm, excuse me, I burped it. I burped it, it was me. Mm. <laughs> Is this a rebel camp? Yes. There's three rebel camps. We could go do one of these rebel camps real quick. That sounds like fun. And then this is the, um... Yeah, yeah, that's where the what's-it-called is. Uh, there's quite a shelter. A lot of unknown stuff here. Oh, another salvage. We should do that, because Andrew was telling me about that off screen. Okay, well, let's, let's head to the shelter then. What's everybody, so what did everybody do today? How was everybody's day so far? Rebel camps. We'll head towards this way, and then we'll uh, we'll do the rebel camp. The source of that signal must be close. They keep saying there's a signal that's close, but I don't understand. We'll take out some rebel camps for now, because I think that'll help us in the. Wait, was it leading me the wrong way? Hello? Game? I'm not even... Then why not just go straight across? And this is the one we... Yeah, that was the one we needed the whatever for. That was actually a really fun way to get um, get a tall neck. That one and the um, and the, the what's it called? The one all the way up north here with the cauldron, the cauldron one. Those two are my fa Those two are really fun, and they're making them more unique, which I like. That one's all the way up north. This is the one I want to do. There we go. And they've got some machines on their outpost. Shooting that with the right ammo should detonate it. They have a Ravager even?
These bristle backs just look like giant boars, which is kind of cool, but also fucking scary. If you know anything about how fucking scary boars can be. This looks like all of them. So. Working with an Osram, I see. Go hide over this way. They'll never see me coming. And you'll never see me coming. Looks like they know where I am. That's alright, your machines don't scare me. Come, Velociraptor, attack! Velocirapti, attack! Velocirapti. Velocirapti, what are you doing? Much better. Let's go after you. <laughs> what killed me there? Holy, they just threw a rock at me and I just died? Okay, well that, that, that can't, that can't go unpunished. Their deaths will not be unpunished. I mean... Told everyone here. You know what? Should I mean. find their leader. Put an end to this. Oh, I got riders on patrol. Great. I'm gonna use something other than fire. You better have my back. This is a great time to go searching for someone. She locked up below the tower. I broke the keys off of it. I can free it. You, you're down. Break your way to it.
again, then. I am the Velosa Master. You shall listen to me. That machine! Stop running, you cowards. And fight! You would be worth more. I guess not. You were not worth the shards I had to use to repair my Velociraptor. Those look like identification tags. I've seen smoke soldiers carry them, but many. The rebels must have looted them from soldiers they killed. I'll keep them safe for now. Figure out what to do with them later. Without a leader, the rebels should abandon this place. But I did we finish it? What do do I just gotta wait? Either way, I'm done here. No, it looks like I finished it. Okay. What am I supposed to do here? Is there more I have to do here? Come on, let me kill him. Okay, well, he's pretty heavily damaged. Heal, 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 jump out of the way, and... Now you're dead. What else is there to do here? It says there's enemies, but I don't see them. It says Rebel Outpost still stands in north. If I just leave the area, it'll be done. because we are completely out. Let me, can I, can I, yes, thank you. And while we're on the way, um, how do I, which one is the thing that,
that. Oh, you can only do it while overriding? That's annoying. Huh. So I can't do it afterwards? Man. Man. Come on, man. I might as well look for healing material then while we're on this way. On the way. Like here. I'm glad I got the survivalist stuff for the healing. That was that was very That has been indispensable. If I had traded this that for anything else, I would be so it's depressed. I would be dying so much more. Something about Poseidon? Eh. Not here for Poseidon. Although that I think that's the area no, never mind. No point using fire against that. It's kind of interesting how they give you the acid arrows first in this game, whereas they gave you the fire arrows first in the last game. And I actually have not gotten a bow that has fire arrows yet. At least I don't think so. Maybe I'm just forgetting. Ah, uh, yes, campsite. Let's uh, quick save. This cost me so much of my uh, points. Mm, that turkey sandwich I had was good. What are... What's going on down here? Hey, thank you for the shards. Ready, go. Might as well collect as many materials as we can, real quick. To knock the knobs wrong, work together. Never thought I'd see the day. Medicinal plants? Yes, please. So many medicinal. I need the medicine. Give me the drugs. Look, I swear it's for medical purposes. I promise, Morty. It's not for fun this time. Save these for when I need it. Alright, here and. Oh, we got all. Wow, we already medicined out. Was this the top of a building? Damn, the sands have really brought this place down. Like, literally. It, what do I think about it so far? I think it's cool. I think it's a cool story. Um, just kind of weird that the big bad seems so easily defeated. I know it's like all of them came up together to fight him. But even then, it should have been a little bit harder. Like, maybe they should have... I don't know. That's just my personal opinion. I like when the be big bad of a season is harder to fight. Not easy. I should find your leader. Kill that Why do I need to fight you when I have my Velociraptor? This is so much more fun, don't you think? Aren't you enjoying this challenge? Is that a rock breaker?
Yep, that's a rock breaker. Ooh, that had gave me some horned lizard materials. Perfect. Well. Should check if there's anything with a lock around here. Anything with a lock, they say. Well done, Velocity. Got some more metal shards for you, so we can use them. Uh, there's more to it, like at the past paragraph, the main villain's not dead yet. Like when they first fight him, it's like episode 30 out of 50. Hmm, I Maybe see. This key will open the chest. There's the thing to open. Lock the tags. I'll have to figure out what to do with them later. Without a leader, the rebels should abandon this place. But I could always deal with them now. By the way, I'm done here. Any others? Hello? I don't see any more. But it says there are more. This place is not that big. That's just a regular charger, right? Shut that machine down quick with shock ammo. Oh no. That's a rebel charger. Kind of annoying that the machines count as rebels, but sure. I'm not ready to fight a rock breaker. I know they want me to go to the core route, but I'm not going to the core route. I'm finishing mission, okay? I finish mission out in the west, then I go to core route. Then we collect machine, eh? Didn't really need a giant arrow for that, but it's fine. It worked out. Can I even do this mission yet? Hmm. Let's let's do this one. Or actually. Those ones are explore missions, and I like them. They just take a while. A Bellabock convoy? Huh. Didn't know those were things. Good to know. Let's do this last outpost. And then we'll uh and then we'll do the main mission. Take out some rebels from the south. Sounds like a plan. That way they have less uh Less of an army to help build them up. Didn't I end it? Didn't I kill all those guys already? Ah, fuck it. Let them be. Are those glint talks? Hmm. Glint hawks are quite annoying. I do not wish to fight them right now. Perhaps in the future, yes? But for now, we avoid the battles. Oh my god, I'm loving writing this. I just, every time I look at the fact that I'm writing a fucking velocity. That's right. There's something down there. I just need to find a way in. Probably need something that I don't have yet. Or there's just a passage that I need to find. Water's pouring out of that building. Exciting story? Better check it out. Uh, 
some other time. Alright, let's get to... Again, only problem, they're a little slow. Only problem with this cool-ass Velociraptor. Really, they should be a little faster, I'm just saying. But I, don't, I won't complain too much. I enjoy what I have. In the next episodes, they fight the first Vice Shogun and they kill him. <gasps> murder, but murder is wrong! You can't kill people. Not unless they... Tremor Tusk Sight. Oh. We can fight a wild Tremor Tusk. That'll be fun. Well, fun is a relative term. Dust swirling. We steer clear. Alright, let's. Oh, the rebels. They'd heard I'd find them here. Getting rid of their leader might cause the rest to leave. But I will destroy you. Where'd she go? You are down. Next. <laughs> you may be a shot shooter, but I am a shot fighter. Judging by that armor, I think I know who's in charge. That was simple. How do you like me now? Who are you? Oh, come on, you. lucky you get to fight me in a single combat you have lived this long and now i end your suffering <laughs> what's up jetsy i know what audio cue i'm going to use for the boobock in the game i'm working on oh what is the audio cue tell me friend i would like to know this information it could be Useful, as they say. Looks like more Tanakh's tags. I'll keep them with me for now. Without a leader, the rebels should abandon this place. But I can't always deal with them now. Wait, who's who's attacking? Either way, I'm done here. That was a burb. Their arrow's coming from somewhere. Ah, from out there. You wish to have a sniper contest? Then let's. These rebels won't be bothering anyone else. Hey, we got a trophy. Nice. We are the 
the trophy takers. All right, here you go. Here's your shards. I know you're hungry. Actually, you know what? Let's take the... Uh, let's take this and head to... Let's do a uh, another melee pit. We haven't done one of those in a while. Those are fun. Okay, come on. We'll just walk over there. I'm gonna use baby crying. Oh my god! That is creepy as fuck, but I love it. What the fuck, man? Why? Why you gotta make things so scary, huh? Why you gotta do this to me? The only reason they fight him in two episodes is because I don't I don't like the design for him, so I want to use it as a le as le least as possible. Why not just make the design better? Or just use a different character as the main villain. Hey, I'm here to beat up all your students and What's you. Going on here? Close combat training. Fighting at long range is a good strategy for machines. But fighting an enemy soldier means getting up in their face. Uh -huh. I'm Lee Rocket. I run the training pit here in Scalding Steel. Cool, cool. I heard you healed the wound in the sand. Mm -hmm. Maybe now the commander will relax the water rations. You can train here if you like. But you're only allowed your spear and a practice bow in the pit. Everything else stays with me. Sounds good. And if you're looking to test your fighting skills, I also offer challenges. Complete all of them, and you'll get to go up against me. And what happens if I beat you? I'll grant you a mark to prove you've mastered this training pit. Cool. If you earn marks from me and the pit masters of the Bulwark and Fern March, you'll earn the right to challenge the Endorian. I think I've heard of the Endorian. Some kind of Tanakh's trainer? More than just a trainer. The Endorian is a legendary fighter among the clans. The master of magic. Oh. Only those who prove themselves in the pits get to train with the Enduring. So he's like the highest level black belt. Got it. You're no ordinary outlander. So, what will it be? Should you want to practice or it burns? What burns? What burn? Tell me. What did you burn? Resonator Blast is the hardest part to get done, in my opinion. Well, we'll try it. Just as you can combine single attacks, you can also chain combinations. Try it with this one. I, I think I already did it. Well, that was easy. Uh, oh, we want to do an aerial. Okay, that's going to be a little hard. Spicy Lover's Pizza Hut. Pizza Hut? Eh, pizza's okay. Pizza, pizza Hut is okay. It's not the best, but it's a good... It's a decent chain restaurant. Rip. I mean... It, that sounds, like, really spicy, though. Hey, is Yuki here, by the way? I'm begging the bird for Wait, what happened? Here's something different. That was simple. I want you to practice using aerial slash to chain into an aerial shot. They get activated so much easier when you're doing the quest, though. That's a nice thing. Uh, put your mind All right, now let's fight this guy. It'll be an easy win. Yuki isn't here at the moment. Sad. Is this the fight you wanted? You delivered that well. You have learned. Skill. Very skilled. Good combination. Now this is an attack. All right. 
I yield. Hey, we did it. First try. Finish all these that was a good fight. Uh, quests. Pretty Super sure had a bruise to remember it by. Here. A mark is promised. Thanks. One down, I guess. Now I just need two Go more. Go to the training pits in the Bulwark and Thornmark. Well, I haven't been to Thornmark yet, marks, so. Then you can challenge the Enduring. Few have ever done so. But I think you might have a shot. And if you want to train more or take on another challenge, let me we'll know. Will do. The pit will always welcome you. All right, okay. I'll be going. Let me know if you want to train in the pit. We'll again. do, we'll do. But for now, let's go destroy them at the... Bulwark. Uh, first, we need a... Oh, is there a new quest up there? Huh. We can go do that later. First, let's go to... Where? I think it's across the way, right? Where is the fire pit? Yeah, it was it was across the way. I was right. John, thank you for contributing 14,000 total scales to stream a horror game challenge. Thank you for that. We are one step closer to making me scream like a little baby girl. Let us see. Does it say what percent we're at right now? Hey, Pitmaster, I want to talk to you. I got you got the same mask as those other it guys. Is. I want to want to do like you've some been to shit. One of the other clans capitals. I'm Arayo. My brother Brock and I run this training pit. Two pit. Watch you bring down the bulwark. It made our day to see our arrogant commander so furious. <laughs> anyway, if you've been to another clan's training pit, then you must know the drill. Yep. Same rules apply. Got here. some special missions for you. You can train or take on a challenge. Only your spear and a practice bow are complete. All of our challenges. And when I beat you, I'll earn a mark? If. And, yes. A token of victory to present to the Enduring. Who is this Enduring, exactly? All I've heard is that they're the best trainer amongst the Tanakh. Earn three marks. <laughs> then you'll see. Is it Chief Hikaru? I swear it's Chief Hikaru. Uh, dodge an incoming attack. Okay. These pit masters' voices do not match the appearance. We're at sixteen percent. Okay, if we get to twenty percent, I'll push it another few days. You can't win a battle if you're dead, and distance will keep you alive. This combination gets you out of trouble and punishes your enemy. It is one of the most fun ones to do, so I understand it. Let's do the next one. Ho, oh, jump over your first opponent. Oh, right, the jump one, and then... Oh, this is good for attacking, too. I can only donate 2,000 stream. That's not your fault. That, that Literally, stream won't let me increase it. on the battlefield is down to tactics your best target isn't always the closest so select your target and strike yep, I got that makes a lot of sense cool let's go to the next training section uh, block breaker Why not have him right in front of me? Okay, how do I jump off? Wait, what? What 
am I doing wrong here? Let's see. R1, R1, R2. Hold R1. Tomorrow. Oh, and then I need to do okay. Got it. I see what I need to do. This one's a hard one to do. To really hurt a defensive opponent, use a block breaker. Then chain it into an attack using a half moon slash. All right, we got that. Now we just have to fight the pit master, which is not hard. The pit masters are actually pretty easy so far. Choose your moment. Where is your confidence? Evasion is protection. You have to win your mark. <laughs> Damn. This is hard. Enough. The challenge is over. Damn, we died. Maybe next time. That was hard. Uh, this time, Go uh, Garo asks the other rangers how to deal with his love with Lucky. So he tells him to be honest with his feelings, and if Lucky is an interest in that, that at least you tried. I mean, yeah, that's the basic thing everybody says. Bring your blade, Outlander. Bring us your best. Brother, that was a good strike. Conviction. I just can't see you. There we go. Are you injured? Keep that I don't like you being behind me. Enough. The challenge is Damn. Over. Okay. Maybe next time. Okay, we got close. We got one down. <clears throat> Make every attack count. Use of evasion. Defeat combination. <laughs> God, you see the way he locks on to me? Use your blade. Challenge me. Go again. Ah, fucking this is hard. God, look at how hard this is, guys. You see this? It's the worst part is that he can just kind of lock on to me sometimes with those combos. 
Defeat is one mistake away. Brother, she hasn't come to me yet. Excellent work. Keep that blade moving. Excellent work. Brock, you need conviction. You've managed to combine attacks. I'll survive. Keep that. You train to fight, so fight. A sharp blade is the best teacher. Good choice. I am fighting. You just don't like the way I'm doing it. You wanted this fight. You all right? Where did she go? Not bad. Nice attack. You took the space. Come on. Enough. Dang it. The challenge is it's over. those blasts. I could have gotten him, but time. for some reason it didn't count as hitting here. It counted as hitting here. When it should have been here. I was aiming right here. You guys saw it. Sometimes it's Use what you reverse taught. aim assist, as I call it. Aim resist, more like it. Good work. Not bad. Good. Stand and fight. Not bad. Excellent combination. Enough. Dang it. The challenge is over. Maybe next time. I'll get him this time. I, I'm getting really close. Hammer time. I wish I could get a hammer. It would be so useful. Fight. Learn. I was not paying attention. And I just took a bunch of free damage because of that. Place to hit. Attack. Concentration. Make a fight of it. Oh, Jesus. Brother? I'm not done. You trained to fight. So fight. I'm not gonna just fight you head on. You have a giant hammer. Brother? Good work. Nice attack. See, challenge is over. Get a scythe. Maybe next time. You know, scythes aren't actually that great of weapons. They don't. They give you range, but. Earn your honor. Besides some cleave damage, it's not super great as a weapon. It's a nice thing that getting knocked down gives you some invulnerability. It seems. Fuck. You need conviction. Fast. 
What was, did you see that kick? That kick did half my health. That was that's annoying. That's super. That uh, we'll try it one more time. One more time. One more time. We got this. We got so close. We just have to remember that when he goes into that red state, he's basically invincible. Right, Outlander. I'll survive. Good combinations. Challenge me. Really? How am I supposed to dodge that? See, what is this? Maybe next time. I literally had that one. And then they were just like Lock on, bam. Fight. Learn. Defeat. Excellent combination. This is fear, not combat. Excellent work. What's the point of dodge if they can just good combination? Lock on. Only one blade out of two. Have to win your mark. Brother? Blade. Good. Not bad. Nice attack. You wanted this fight. I'm letting him cool down so it doesn't have that weird rage mode. Or I guess they can just leap to me. Maybe next time. Another one. Damn it, Crimson! Damn it, John! Stop trying to Okay, fine, fine. We'll keep going until we win. Earn your mark. Bring us your best. You have mastered combining attacks. You all right? I am not done. This is fear, not combat. Well, I'm waiting for you to come to me. Huh? I went. I went sideways. Maybe next time. John! No more practice. You just like seeing me get beaten up, don't you? You hurt? I can go. Not bad. Nice attack. Good work. Fight! Stand and fight. She 
hasn't beaten me yet. And now, the challenge is Did you guys over. see that? Did I just Maybe get one-shotted? Is that a one-shot attack? How? That, it lo Make every attack count. What am I supposed to do about Maybe that? Can you literally... I certainly do. I don't know about John, though. Make a fight of it. Uh, at first, uh, Garo tries to be nice and romantic with Lucky, but Lucky is about as dense as a brick. So he eventually just emits that he has a crush on him, and now he's looked up to him ever since they met. And Lucky says yes to go out with him. Okay, weird. All right. Honestly, relationships in those kind of shows are kind of weird. Just when they're the center, that is. That's one of the reasons I don't think Cora did that well, is because even in back in season one, relationships were like half the show, and then they made them bad. Did you teach her that? Especially the worst kind of relationships. Um, Love triangles. Challenge me. Good. Good combination. But you aren't finished. How do I? The challenge is over. Maybe next time. How do I dodge that? Like, how do I eat the gum gum fruit chain? Oh, the gum gum fruit. So I'd be uh, immune to electricity. Bring your blade, Outlander. Using the space. I wasn't allowed to dodge. I was literally pressing circle and I wouldn't move. So you can just throw a rock at me that I can't even dodge too. I know I have no. You mean intention, not attention. Intention. Bring your blade, Outlander. Just let them hit me. Fuck it. Enough. The challenge is over. Maybe next time. Does it make it weirder that it's been an alien wolfman and a human warrior? Um, sort of, not really. It just, you, there's no show of their relationship. You can't keep running. Why does he have so many attacks that he can use? It's so weird. No more practice. Win. A good use of evasion. Is it? I still What? What was that? I just got up. And then... Enough. The challenge is over. That Maybe depends on how time. Wolfman the Wolfman is. That's true. That does depend on that. 
Because if they're more wolf than man, then yes, it's weak. But they're more man than wolf. Is it though? Good combination. I just can't see you. I'm not trying to dodge. I'm not trying to run away. I just can't see. Brother? I am not done. Good. Combinations. A still blade is a useless blade. this fight? Where is your confidence? Enough. God damn it! Challenge is over. Sometimes he does. Maybe next time. There's one Super Saiyan that did love triangle as well, and that's Jetman. That's you know you got a point there. Sharp blade is the best teacher. Enough training. Fight. This is fear, not combat. My. You need conviction. Stand and fight. And now, the challenge is over. Maybe next time. Okay, one more time, and then we're done. Seriously, this is gonna be the last time. Earn your honor. Enough training. The fact that he just starts with that attack is really annoying. I should be allowed to dodge out of that if I mid ability. Choice of attack. Excellent work. Good combination. Okay, now, yeah, I'm done with this for now. Let's go over. do, uh, can you up Maybe your health? No. I can't heal at all. That's what makes this really hard. Otherwise, I would have finished by now. I should have we'll finish this some other time. Come back if you want to challenge us. Uh, we'll do that rebel outpost some other time. There's a rebel camp down here that I want to do sometime. I'm glad that we know where a Tremor Tusk side is, and a th I think we know where a Thunderjaw side is as well. And we know where a Plowhorn side is, which will be useful later. Alright, let's go do the main mission. Oh, this is the closest camp, okay. I was trying to find a camp, and I'm like, where's the camp? No, I can't increase the health pool. You just increase it by leveling up. Uh, and I think... I think when you go into those, it caps you at a certain amount. So, yeah. <gasps> Wait, what did I... What's the boost? Health? <gasps> oh, no, it's a damage boost. That's right. This will be very useful because I love stealthing. Okay, we need another point for this, which we'll get by the end of this next mission. 
I'm checking something. Does he need to be repaired at all? No, my cloth chair doesn't. We should just stop repairing it then. Just revive it only only revive it. Outlander. Chief Akaro and Marshal Katalo await you within. Understood. The core root should be starting soon. Once it's done, I'll be able to access the chamber below Hikaro's throne. And ether. Outlander, the chief awaits you in the arena, past the throne. Am I gonna become a marshal? Is that it? Huh, more data points. This must lead to the arena. This is a cool looking area. Whoa, look at this huge temple in the forest. It's another part this of must the be the Redwood Forest. Turned into a fighting ring. Or Golden Gate Park. Aloy, it seems you've had to move mountains to bring Well, Skycraft in a sense, all I did was really break a piece of it. Katalo helped. Yes. Takote reprimanded for all the clan to see. You both served well. <laughs> but now the cool route is at hand. Some have come to compete, others to bear witness. They know Regala will come for you. I'll do whatever it takes to hold up my end, as long as you remember yours. So what's the plan? Katalo. There are only two viable ways to attack the arena. Through the throne room you just passed, and by the trail on the north end. We've set up barricades at both. But if Regala means to assault the cool route with machines, she will have to attack by the trail. That makes a sense. You will join our defenders there. Hold the line, and I'll have my marshals. Free of my service and receive your reward. Well, so long as you Whatever keep your word, which I believe you, you will. Once the cool route begins, you must see it through. The grove, the arena, it's all part of the same ancient structure? Yes. Here the land remembers the sacrifice of the ten. Their deeds commemorated for eternity. Sacrifice? The visions tell us that on the ground below, they gave their lives in a fight against machines. Huh, the interesting. This must be some story we don't know about. Fell. I know where I'll be. What about you two? I will be here with the chief, where I belong. Should the fight reach us, we will take the blood oath for our fallen. If. It comes. Very honorable way of putting it, and I like the way how he's like hoping that they won't have to fight. All right, let's get started. Let's get this over with. Good. You'll find Decca at the north barricade with the rest of our defenders. Strike true as the ten. I'll see you when this is done. Understood. Let's finish this. There's armor in that chest. Take it. It might prove. Armor. Good. Oh, what the heck? I didn't even realize I bought this. Uh, plus two weapon stamina, plus one valor surge master, plus one critical strike, plus one resilient trapper. Hmm. Let's see. Plus stealth, tear, heavy weapon, low health regen. Let's wear this one for now. May it keep you safe. The title Marshall's coming. Must be earned with in the air. Can I upgrade my armor then? Don't have any of that material. I like that there's more reasons to go out and just hunt machines for materials. And soon we will march against her. 
with a strength that she will not understand. Oh, come on. East of her. Didn't think the Sky Commander himself would be joining us today. If there's a chance, my challengers will be facing Regala. It is only right their commander join in their fate. Or maybe you need to save face after what happened at the bulwark. <laughs> Careful now. Sometimes sharp wits bring out sharp spears. Sometimes they do. I'd save my spear for Regala's troops, if I were you. But in these cases, they will not. If I fail out, if I fall out of a tree and no one is around to hear, what color is the road on the Tuesday night on Halloween during Christmas? Wait, hold up. That doesn't, that, 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 what, that question is not correlated at all. I am confused beyond belief. Okay. Are you on something, Dutchie? More dacha. Dacha, give me the dacha. I don't know what dacha is, but I want more. I want more of it. You are not alone in this fight. Is there a way up? A rock. This will help us kill the machines. I don't think this is the way they want you to get up there. But... And you can't get up there. Oh, there's a ladder there. I'm blind. I think we've all established that I am blindo. I know that's not really Focus a word, but... on the machines. Take them down, and Regala's forces become no different from that our That is a good way of looking at it, I'm correct. Watch each other's backs. Dismissed. Our soldiers are ready. Good. They will defend the cool route from below, or from above. Not that. Where did you get it? One of our squads drifted off a fallen machine. The honor is yours. Are we certain? Regala may have her tricks, but you will show her our teeth. Sounds like a plan. Our sun wing's gonna come in from the ring. Oh, hey, look! Cloudhorn. And claw striders. Dunno! The cool root is upon us! Our struggle demands new blood! New leaders! Let us find Release our new for leaders for peace and for protection. I love to pump shotgun from T2. Challengers, the answer above. in pineapple. I am what you might call confused. All who take down a machine shall be named Martian. Remember the ten. Strike from the air as they did and see your glory. I'm guessing at least one of the girls will become a marshal. Her specifically, because they showed her a lot. That feels like a tremor tusk. Oh no, just a bunch of boss riders and a ravager. Oh, that's a Ravager gun. Hold them back! Defend the cool route! Well, this is easy. The 
fact that we have infinite ammo is nice. What? I didn't want to do that. Okay, well, I'm invisible now. Let's change our skill to, uh... Denver! Is there another uh, machine gun I can use over here? Sorry, little Vodacy right there. Come on, stop going behind the door. There we go. The roller back. I think I was just standing there like, oh, I guess I'll get hit. Anything else? Looks like we got all the machines. Lots of parts for you to harvest now. Maybe I should teach you how to use the machine. Tremor Tusk incoming. There. Yep. Or is that a rock breaker? Rock breaker? I don't know. No way. Or is this a new machine? Hold the defenses. Go. I swear this is a rock breaker. Looks like I'm going into the ring. Yep, rock break. And there she is, Regala. How'd they climb out so fast, by the way? That is a big tunnel they climb out of. I'm gonna leave soon, so what do you think I'm wrong? It's fine. Oh yeah, we're playing a game. You are a thorn in my side, Regala. And soon all you shall be is a splinter I once knew. The first Oh, it wasn't one of these things. Get to the weapon! If I can draw that thing close, open fire! Hey! That's right, over here, you big worm! Take this thing down and catch up to Regala. Hopefully the Dunas will fire a few shots from that ballista. What is it weak to again? Fire, ice, and uh, whatever the purple stuff is. I, Let's bring I think that that's thing down. shock. The 
thing we got on that chill water earlier. Break these gears. Oh god, it's coming, it's coming at us, it's coming, we gotta dodge. Okay, let's hunk you down again. Two critical strikes, nice. Come on, just one more. Break the sack. Haha, <laughs> you fool. You fell right from my trap. <laughs> Twice. Okay, that thing is dead. One way to kill it. For materials for me, at least. Now we gotta go help Ch Chief Akaro. We need to get Aether as soon as possible. Chucking boulders around is uh, super fun. Well, I'm glad you enjoy that. I'm glad they gave us the chance to get the materials. 
Thanks for creating me a little path, Snakey. Champion, get to the chief. They make me get to the chief. I'll help as many as I can along the way, though. Chief, I won't let you die till I get Aether. You're still too useful for me. Again, I will stop you. I am the hero of the East, and soon I will be a warrior of the West. You may be strong, and you may be smart, but I am above you in all places. This isn't finished. As a great dragon I'll lord, I shall breathe I fire have. down upon you and your people, and, and leave nothing but ash. Will be run red. <laughs> you are funny, Regala. You think you can finish me? I defeated the Shadow Carja. I defeated Hades. I brought back Gaia, and I shall save the world Attention. and destroy you. You fought well. Proved yourself against enemies both metal and flesh. I name you all, Marshal. Your first order is to secure the arena from any remaining rebels. Go. I should have finished with Dala, but now she'll be back with more machines, stronger than ever. I'll do what I can to help. No, you've done enough. Far more than our bargain called. <laughs> I like how honorable when you are. When we first met, you spoke of your true mission on which all depends. I wasn't certain if I believed you then, but I believe in you now. Hmm. Well, thank you. Believe me, and get to your task. What will you do? Tend to the wounds. What you need is there. Take it. Your deeds today will be remembered like those of the ten. Why doesn't Aloy shoot this bitch? She might not have had a good uh, angle, or she might have just blocked the shot, so why waste the arrows? And, you know, plot armor. Damn, that kind of hurt. It'll be fine, though. There. Aether. That console. Hello. Come on, Aether. Time to go home. Yes. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master Alpha Right activated. Restoring Aether's subordinate function to original code. Get this back to Gaia. Damn, what it was this a huge Hades. server? The words of the ten are not hearsay. Whoa, they're talking about some vision up there. And this one just Whoa. There was something here, too? Some sort of vision? Huh, ruined, but... Still... Oh! The White House! Please, Aloy. Come here. Cool. 
the visions throughout the grove are different now. And this one, it just appeared. Is this your doing? The visions have changed. That's the one that inspired Chief Hakaro. More testimony of the old ones. Hear now the words that reunited a people. Following the tragic events of the war, Anne Faraday, the chief architect of the reconciliation effort, addressed a nation in need of hope. If we look into the future, the lens of the recent past, our fears loom. Wars waged against machines. Scarcity of food. Wow, and sounds water. very uh, relevant to today. Storms that drive literally us from our what's homes. happening right now. But true courage means facing those fears with conviction instead of cynicism. Leading the peacekeeping effort with these brave men and women, these marshals of the new Southwest, has strengthened my conviction. I told you she'd become a marshal. When we are united, we can overcome any threat. Join me. Join us in that conviction as we strive for a nation and a world without want or war. Are they going to do the U.S. Army salute from now on? Yep, oh my god, they did it. They did the salute. They all do this now. <laughs> We're so strong, we've even in uh, indoctrinated people from the future. Mostly plot armor? Yeah, I'd say about 40% plot armor. Maybe 50 Reporting for duty, Commander. I'm coming with you. Oh, or is he going to be another person Carl we teach? Needs you. Because of you, he has new marshals. And a rallying cry the clans cannot ignore. So I will stand with you on your mission. Cool, I like that we're getting more allies. Give whatever is left of my life. That's a death flag. That's a huge death flag. He's gonna die. How can I say no to that? So, there's someone who wants to join us. I need you to meet him in the foothills and guide him the rest of the way. Will do, Aloy. Go to the mountains, west of Plainsong. A friend of mine will meet you on the ascent. I'll join you when I can. A friend of yours should be interesting. <laughs> That's only the half of it. All right, I need to get Info back to Gaia. It seems like Capture might did something to the other holograms too. Might be worth checking out. Oh yeah, let's see the other hologram. Observe the grid of JTF-10 in the mountainous regions of the hot zone. Trained to outlast, conditioned for any climate. JTF-10 were elite defenders in even the most remote mountain landscapes. Mm -hmm. Was that the whole thing? I guess that's the whole thing. Discover how JTF-10 claimed home field advantage in the desert. JTF-10 seized key assets all across the desert. Where others feared the Mojave's raging sandstorms, uh -huh. JTF soldiers used them for cover, crippling enemy supply lines. I see. So that's the, so it's not actually that there were 10 of them. It was a group called JTF-10. Interesting. Blood of the 10, Aloy. Regala denied. The truth of the visions revealed. I doubt you have enough skin to mark all your deeds. <laughs> we all just have to remember them. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> well, thanks to you, 
The chief still lives. And hope remains. Hey, it was part of the deal, wasn't it? But that's not why I wanted to speak with you. I need a favor. A person Look, okay, if you want me to kill you, I'll do it, but only if I can use He's this. Not counted among the dead, which means he must still be with Regala's oh, remaining never mind. Okay. forces. He was taken prisoner. No. He joined them willingly. That is unfortunate. Like many young soldiers who seek to mark their skin with distinguished deeds. I must search for him. Convince him to come home. Chief Hikaru cannot spare any soldiers for this task, so my blade is alone in this. I like how you understand this, and you don't blame him. You just feel I know sad about the situation. I know it is much to ask after all you've done for us. But Kavo is the last of my blood. Why'd he join the rebels? What made Coming Kavo to save the motherfucking the day, America! Fuck yeah! Vengeance against the Fuck, the pizza's still burning. <laughs> it wasn't easy to turn the clans back. <laughs> Many to I love that I read that and I just see Meridian. the pizza's still burning. Oh, so that's great. The embassy, they Wonderful. To arms. Yes. But others? The young, especially? By the way, how does it Tell look? Does Do I look good on the camera right now? Does this look good? Let me know. There's probably a bit of both. And a youthful desire for a cause to get the blood burning. Nothing. I don't look too white, too orange. You said Kavo is your last living relative? Yes. Before Chief Ikaro, the clans wore constantly. I heard of that, yes. Every skirmish claimed another comrade. Mm, sounds one unfortunate. One by one, I buried my children. And then you bury your children, your grandchildren? That is saddening. I'm sorry. I tried to vent my grief on the battlefield, but I never found comfort there. And that's why you became only in the wisdom of the vision. And one of the so, um, what are they I called? still couldn't prevent Cavalry. One of the seers. The trail I'll just of say. Blood. So if Cavo didn't listen to you when he joined the rebels, what makes you think he will now? Cabo was too young to fight during the Red Raids. Moa was a stranger to him. But he must have experienced the suffering it brings by now. He will listen. Fabulous. Yes, truly fabulous. I just have to find him before it's too late. If Cabo joined Regala's rebellion of his own accord, will Hikaru let him back into the tribe? The chief knows the value of mercy and the toll of unending bloodshed. The rest of the tribe I'm more concerned about. They won't quickly accept someone who betrayed them. Even with my support, it won't be easy. Then you have to try. I'll help you find your grandson, if I can. Where do we start? A while back, our scouts reported Cavo's squad left one of Regala's outposts in the hills to the south. His squad never returned, but the scouts also spotted one of our own being held captive. So we'll start at the outpost. If we free the prisoner, maybe they'll know where Cavo's squad went. Shall we head out? Uh, I'll meet you there. I have some other things to take care of first. I can meet you there. I'll wait for you on the hill crest southeast of the grove. We'll, we'll do that as soon as we bring back um, Aether. Until then, strike true. Uh, this way, right? It's nice that you guys can see the visions again. Stop cooking my armor in this heat. Uh, where is it? There it is. Blood for the blood god, yes. Bring me all the blood I need. That way I can make more blood people. I don't ask me how I do it. It's it's a very difficult process. I wish that it teleported you directly into the base and not just to the fireplace next to the base. It's kind of annoying when it's like, oh, I think it's because they just programmed everything to teleport you to the fire. Yep. To the fireplaces. And so the game, it's just kind of hard to change where it teleports you. 
But at least it's easy to get up here. Let's cure the airs. The wind. The sky. We have a new friend. Welcome to the base. Like this? Hey, Aaron's oh, learning. Uh, you're not waving a hammer around, Aaron. Try a gentler touch. And my big sausage fingers don't really do gentle, okay? <laughs> Bring it back, trace the line, to your right, other right. I just saw it. It's the one Aloy found up north. Gotcha. Is he listening to music? They call it a, a concussion beat party or something. Yeah, now that's music. <laughs> oh my god, he's such a boomer. Aloy! But in the best way. Aaron, you're all better. And you're here. Well, the world only goes on. If you can do your thing, we learn fast enough, we help make that happen. I like this. I like all these different all tribes coming together and right learning now. the tech of the old we ones. We still have much training to do, of course. One does not become hunter in a day. Each seed grows at a pace of its own. Doesn't mean it won't bloom. You should know your Tanakh friend arrived. Katalo. I heard their warriors drink people's blood. I want to sleep with one eye open. I think he's seen enough blood for a lifetime. Yeah, he's literally I'm missing sure he's an arm. Wounds. He seems to appreciate the privacy. Uh, looks like you've got things under control. I should get this to Gaia. Right. We'll keep on training. Catch up as fast as we can. I'm seeing glyphs in my dreams already. Well, while you've been off gallivanting around, I've been working with Gaia to find out more about the land gods. So from where I'm standing, you're in need of some training. I kind of like them together. Come along. It's really cute. Uh, oh, uh, okay. I like Varl's nervousness. He's like, what's up with that? I don't want to talk about it. Okay, you just walk away. Pretend we didn't see nothing. Often we return to the base dialogue with the companions will update as you progress through the story. New dialogue is indicated by an exclamation point. Yay! New dialogue! I love lore. I love talking to friends. So what would happen if I time traveled to their time? Huh. That's a good question. Welcome back, Aloy. When you're ready, please merge Ether with me. Afterwards, I must discuss an important matter with you. You get the power to control the winds. So, what did you want to discuss? While you were away, I received an unusual transmission on my dedicated Eluthia frequency. Okay. Eluthia. That's one of the sub-functions you couldn't Oh, the one with before. the... to create people. Yes. The transmission occurred so slowly that at first it seemed like an accidental blip of data amongst background static. That must be super slow. Once I noticed this irregularity, it took some time to collate the complete message. She's been taken by Farzina. SOS. Where does it lead? To a mountain to the northwest of this facility. Of caution, Aloy. It is possible this transmission is genuine. It is also possible it is being broadcast by someone or something else. You don't think it's actually Eluthia? I am uncertain. What's SOS? It is an old world code. A distress signal. A desperate plea. Save our souls. A lot of people don't know it means save our souls. Why would Eluthia send a coded transmission on a frequency only the two of you can communicate on? I believe it was done as a precaution to avoid detection, or at least to create the appearance of the desire yeah, to Yeah, it's either so. her trying to be I sneaky or someone else trying to trick us. Why only two Eluthia options. Eluthia would expect that I would be able to detect and respond to its distress signal at all. As far as it is aware, I no longer function. Okay, so 
Either Aluthia is in trouble and sent the message hoping we were out there. Or someone else is trying to get us to go to these coordinates, pretending to be Aluthia. That is my conclusion as well. Could it be for Zenith? Could the Zeniths be sending the transmission? According to the data I reviewed on your focus, the Zeniths recovered the other Gaia root kernel in the Hades Proving Lab. It is feasible they used it to gain access to my internal frequencies. So, maybe they sent it thinking you'd respond and reveal your location. Possibly. However, the transmission is highly irregular. If they intended to provoke me into revealing myself, I would expect the communication to be more routine. Right. So maybe it's not them, then. You said the coordinates lead to a mountain to the northwest. What's yeah, that? I'm curious. I have no record of anything of note in that vicinity. Okay, and what about the other number in the message? 237. Any idea what that means? It says beware at the bottom. I have my available databases, but it does not appear to have any significance. Perhaps its meaning can only be understood at the indicated coordinates. Alright, I'll go to the coordinates and check out the source of the transmission. All by yourself? Ha! No way. I included Aaron and Barl in this briefing via their focuses. I concur that you should not invest... I like this. I like how even she's on our side like, come on. Let's have more friends. it could be a trap. But if it really is Eleuthia, then it's in trouble, and I need to bring it then back. Then we'll do it together. Don't worry. I'll be careful and we're coming with you. Better to have friends than nothing. Fine. Go grab your things. <laughs> I like how she's like, yeah, I don't like with the West exit having to rely on people. In case you need to upgrade your gear. Uh, is there something? I'm waiting for this to turn off. Error. Drone feed disconnected. Oh, okay, so I need to find those drones and connect the feed. Okay. That makes more sense. Mission time. Yes, mission time. How long is the streaming going on? Three hours? Four hours? Somebody do an uptime for me, please. And... to know. I'll check it out when I can. Where's this other room? Is this it? Gotta go after Eleuthia. Erend and Barl are waiting for me at the west exit. Well, I'm just trying to find this other room that I was just told about. Is this it? Oh, I've been down here before. It's where I first got into the facility. Oh, this isn't it. No, oh, let's talk to what's her name first. Why have I seen this before? Hi ya. Chair's right in my way. Barl looks happy about his training partner. Learning is best done together. I see you've settled in. Gaia did say this place was built for us. That is technically true. So we could regain control of our lands with her terraforming system. Nurture them. Uh, three the hours. Plainsong's fields. Zagger dis dim sum. Uh, oh, dim sum. Uh. Never. I can't see the Batman this Sunday, unfortunately. I might be able to join you for dim sum, but I can't go to the Batman. You've spoken with Katala? A few words. Tanakh don't have much use for us outsiders. You must have made. Uh, cause Claire wants to see it, and she's working that day. That's why. You've been getting to know Erend, I assume. 
Of course. Any friend of Varl's is a friend of mine. In this case, a very loud friend. Yeah, he is a bit loud, but that's kind of his people. Right. Sag, I, I know. Is it, is it true you're investigating a signal coming from one of Gaia's seedlings? Maybe. We'll know for sure when we check it out. Be careful. We will. I always am. Except for, you know, those times. Did she just start walking into a wall? Aloy, we've gathered some supplies in that chest. Take what you need. I'll take all of it. Looks like someone's made this space their own. I see you found Varl and Zoe's room, Aloy. I believe they wanted private accommodations. That's fair. A nice mix of their two cultures. Hello, Katoro. Aloy. It's good to see you. I'm guessing you've got a lot of questions. I've been told of our enemy and their intentions. Your friends showed me to the vision you keep in this place. Gaia. And gave me this focus. I don't pretend to fully understand everything, but all I really need to know is where to train and when to fight. Welcome to the team. <laughs> I like that. Very straightforward, very honorable. What are you looking at over there? The others have been helping me decipher the symbols the folks showed ah, me. Ah, English. So, I thought I'd try to understand the weapon you intend to use against the enemy. This Hephaestus, it will be able to make machines? That answer to Gaia? Yes. How many? Ads, sad, sad. Such power. Has the world ever seen the light? Now that you know who the enemy is, do you have any questions? I'll admit, I find them hard to grasp. From the heavens. And invulnerable. For now. We will find a way. We I will pierce their defenses you. and leave them just as vulnerable as you are when you lost your arm. But deepest. a lot weaker. You've had some time with the team now. Any thoughts? I admit, I was surprised to see Nutaru here. Farmers don't make for effective soldiers. I'm told she rallied some in her tribe against the Karja, and fought all the way to Baron Light. Interesting. Perhaps I like how open-minded the characters she ends up meeting are. I'll let the rest of the companion. You've had some time. Any thoughts? I admit, our farm make for hmm. effect. I'm told she rallied some in her truck and fought all. Interesting. Not mentioning the others. That's kind of annoying, but oh well. I should go. Feel free to check in on Hikaru and your people. Doors always open here. I will. I overheard that Varl and Erend are to accompany you on a mission. Do you require my assistance? I'd rather have you and Zoe guard the base while we're away. It shall be done. May the ten walk with you. I like how they all have their different cultures, and yet they all just work together. Did I get any parts that I can use? I did. Just those. Just the Ravager parts. Okay. Okay, then. So many more machines left to unlock. I can't wait. Where's this new door, by the way? She said she opened a new door, but I don't... <gasps> That's their quarters. Holograms. Gaia, I thought you said the data here was lost. I was able to repurpose the equipment to store the data you have acquired in your Figures travels. Figures what I've done. Cool. <laughs> Looks like Aaron and Catalo moved their stuff in. Very different stuff. One is very wood-based and another is very metal-based. But I like it. Oh, looks like I can open that door now. Which door? Is this door? Gaia, what was this room for? This was intended to be a recreational room for control center operatives. Oh, for games. Unfortunately, the entertainment modules were lost with the Apollo database. Oh, that's too bad. 
damn it, all their video games are gone? What is this? I'm guessing this was an armory. Wait, is there a door here that I can open now? No. These were very small. I guess it was only supposed to be like a team of 10 or 20. The room won't open. Guess Gaia hasn't been able to restore access yet. Tunnel. There's data here. Another room. What for? Switch to a private lock? Okay, so reaching on control center nine. Design of the facilities coming along. Oh. Can I can I get through here? Guess I can't. Unless. Let's just, I forget, you can just scan it. Switch to a private lock? Okay, so, reaching on control center nine. Design of the facilities coming along. When Gaia find- Dang it. Oh, I'm back in the sleeping quarters. Switch to a private okay, lock. Okay, we'll just walk through here while we- Okay, so. Reaching on control center nine. Design of the facilities coming along. When Gaia finally builds it, it'll have everything it needs. Except personality. So, I'm going to sneak in my own mark. A, a couple of flourishes. Starting with this little tucked away hideout. Ah, nice. Marcus would have gotten a kick out of it. He loved hidden passages, like the kind in old English castles. But I've got something bigger planned. A piece of resistance, if you will. Wait, what is this here? Oh, is this a farming tool? Interest. Oh, is she farm? She's planting here. Oh, cool. Huh. Looks like someone's rearranged stuff in here. Hey, Lord. I see you found. Oh, this is my room. Your companions thought you would appreciate a private space of your own. I was thoughtful of them. I've been carrying Elizabeth's pendant with me for months. But since we're gonna stay a while, I think I'll keep it here. Where it'll be safe. Cool, I guess there's more pendants you can get. My old spear. Rust helped me make Aww, it. Aw, that's sweet. When I finished my training. Feels like so long ago now. I miss Rost. He was such a great dad. This is the rite of passage that Vishal gave me at the embassy. I liked him. He seemed like a good man. He truly did. He was really looking forward to going home. At least he will be buried in the Sundom. We have so much stuff in our stash. We have the one striker piece we found. And here's those other, uh... John uses crab squid. What if we get to the end and find out that Hades wasn't rogue, but the others are? And Hades was trying to stop them. No, no, no. Hades was rogue. We know for a fact that he was rogue. That'd be some M. Night Shyamalan shit. The mother of all plot twists. Can we go uh, find that AI? Yeah, okay, I'll go find the AI. I was just looking around. Look, it's not important. The world's just gonna end in a couple of months. Cheese and crack. There she is. Look, I was just you looking around. Out. Yeah, let's get going. Let's go. Look at us. Three battle-hardened badasses forging into the unknown. This ought to be good. <laughs> I 
Oh, they just skipped to you climbing. Okay, cool. And it makes sense Aaron is the slowest at climbing. Because he's, he's more a muscle guy, not a climber. The Nora are heavy climbers. They live in the mountains, so it makes a lot of sense. What is up here? I'm quite curious. Farzina. And Shadow Karcha? Or not to not. Oh, they broke one of the machines. So it is possible to get it. Wow, they killed a Farzina, or at least damaged her. Okay, so everyone just died. Well, that takes the keg. <laughs> I love Aaron's reaction. <laughs> Did not think we would be running to Farzenith again. Not this early. Burl. See if there's anything over there? On it. I'll check out the battlefield. Let's start with that zenith. Oh, there are obviously more zeniths than we know about. Can't believe you fought one of them. Almost didn't make more it. More like escaped. Snow crunch under my boots. Whatever the rebels did. It took down her shield. But why was she here? I can access her last communication file, but I'll use my focus to scan the battlefield too. What about that crazy weapon the Zenith had? It looked like she can make it come and go at will. But it's gone now. Yeah. Well, go do your thing. I'll wait here. Let's see. What is there to scan? Hmm. Looks like our machine also got destroyed. The Spectre had instructions to assist recovery of the asset. Probably a Luthia. This asset is. Getting that off so we have it ready. Something's over here, it looks like. Oh, a stalker! Hey, I haven't seen one of those in a while. I've been using your tech though. Thanks for that. Sorry, not sorry. I need it. Up here. Right. What happened to these guys? Blown up by their own weapon, it seems. One of the sons of Prometheus. Hmm. It looks like his focus was sending data on the weapons somewhere else. How could you? Foxes are sacred. No, they are food. The weapon's still hot. I need food to know how it food. worked. There is no sacred animal, not even a dragon. I'll have to check on it once it's if cooled a off. dragon can be killed and eaten, then it deserves it. Thank you, Rabbit, for giving me useful materials. I will use it for later. Uh, what did I pick up? Some sort of ammo? Purge water damage is now available. Oh, sweet! Use your phone to say... Huh. Looks 
like there's more points of contact over this way. This will be in my stash when I need it. Have a look around. I'll wait here. This looks like a tunnel that they created. I guess there's more to look around for. Hmm. It should show Varl doing the same thing. Is that a... No, I already did that. What else is there to scan? I feel like I missed something. You done looking around? Almost. Ah, over here, okay. What is this? So they were waiting for them? Looks like the rebels camped here for a while. Are they watching this area? Did they know something was gonna happen? All right, I think I have an idea what happened here. I better get back to Errant. Looks like the tunnel is the way to go. Agreed. Okay. All right, so she who sees something. the unseen. What did you find out? This was a carefully planned attack. I found camping gear up there. The rebels must have been staking out this place for at least a few days. They were waiting for the Zenith to show up. All so that they could test that weapon. The Zeniths have a personal shield that makes them invulnerable, but somehow the weapon got rid of it. The Os room that was operating it was sending data on it somewhere else. It was probably just a prototype. But it worked, even as a prototype. The only problem is I've no tinkers that do that. I'd do a little trial run before breaking out the real thing. Well, I guess it's still a work in progress, if it blew up. She was searching for something she lost. Her drone had instructions to recover something called the asset. The asset? Is that the uh, sub-function thing that you said could be here? Alufia? It could be. I'm not sure. It could be something else, though. Come on, let's go talk to Varl. Asset usually means something that you want or works in a positive light for you. It could be anything from money to a person to Aluthia. Down the tunnel we go, like Alice it's in Wonderland. Something tunneled straight down into the mountain. Looks recent. Whatever it was, it must have been powerful. That zenith the rebels killed was looking for something called... The Asset. I don't know where it is. But my guess is it's somewhere down there. All right, so we head down. Aaron, stay here and stand watch. That zenith isn't the only one of its kind. I don't want to be caught by surprise if the others show up. Contact us by focus if you see anything. Okay. If any trouble shows up, I'll call you. Please don't kill Aaron. Please don't kill Aaron. I love Aaron. The SOS coordinates. There's some kind Whoa, there's a base of in the old world ruin down here. You said the Zeniths have their own backup of Gaia, right? Yeah. From the Proving Lab. Is there going to be a dark guy in there? So now? maybe they were after Eleuthia. Found its hiding spot, so it sent the distress signal. Maybe. This feels like a trap. Calling Bentley. This was a far zenith research lab. It looks like a lot of data was beam cast from here recently. From that device nearby. So Eluthi is gone? If it was ever here, then probably. Then why were the Zeniths still searching for the asset? 
Let's keep looking around. This is an enigma wrapped so, in a question. So, exploring another far zenith ruin. Wrapped in a mystery. At least this one doesn't seem to have giant killer machines. Or anything, or anything you can blow up. Haha. -ha. Technically not untrue. So one of their old far zenith research labs. No wonder we didn't know that. It was hidden from us. Not part of our group. Maybe that'll give me a hint as to what they were doing here. As you undoubtedly have heard by now, we have lost the brightest star among us. Research on ectogenesis for the Odyssey was near and dear to Peter, and on behalf of the new High Council, I commend you all for your efforts and the great strides made over the last several years. Commend, not command, my bad. Yet, as we mourn our founder, we must also keep our gaze on the bright future ahead. To that end, we will be shifting project priorities. Over the coming days, you will be briefed on exiting developments in longevity research from our Tokyo and Lagos facilities, with new assignments to follow. In the meantime, all ectogenetic chambers should be moved to storage. Refer to your leads with any questions. Interesting. Suspicious to all say All this there. stuff. I wonder what they were doing here. Well, knowing far zenith, probably find anything that might tell us things. what the asset is. I don't think so. Data corrupted has been has been significant improvement decreasing the time between touch-ups that commercially available treatments like Osmanthus's rejuvenate rejuvenate require. As for Malik's team, the latest results from our neurophysiology experiments seem promising. And with the supplementary data provided by our Tokyo facility, we seem to be closing in on a functional first-generation implant. Meanwhile, our friends in Zurich have sent over their findings on WBM. Mixed results, a couple of promising avenues, but anything bordering on real digital trans uh, transcendence looks to be decades away, if not directed data corrupted. If all the programs are as intelligent as Gaia, maybe this one hit, uh, has hidden herself as a white noise, that is a possibility. Oh. But I don't think they're all as intelligent as guys. I think they're all like near guys intelligent, but not quite true AIs. And then they were forced to become AIs, which made them all paranoid and scared in, for different reasons and in different ways. That's why when we met uh, Minerva, she was talking about, uh, we said we could uh, help her emerge with guys. And she said, would that make the pain go away? Because they were never meant to be true This place is huge. Some kind of storage room, maybe. It looks like they were... Maybe the asset is in here somewhere. If it is, somehow the Zenith couldn't find it. Let's look it around. looks like this place was a place to study... Um, so, um... How is Aaron taking all of this? Really? Well... Gaia, the Zeniths... Focus. It's a lot. But when I caught up to him in the dawn, the he control said he needed our help. He dropped to everything and turned units. around. Can it tell us if the asset is in one of them? Well, let's find okay, out. before I keep moving, because new dialogue keeps coming up and I want to listen to it. It looks like this was a place where they were originally studying pods to rejuvenate people and allow them to continue to have longer lifespans, which is something I am suspicious of. Let's see, we need a code. 236 containers in storage. Please enter the container number you'd like to retrieve. 236? Wasn't there a number in the distress signal? You're right. I should check the log. Um, let's look at character bios real quick just to get these out of the way.
Black Box, Man vs. Machine, RCC. Oh, right. Two, three, seven. Two hundred and thirty six containers in storage. Please enter the container number you'd like to retrieve. Do you think Farzina's people have the missing AIs? Uh, which missing AIs? Well, remember, you mean the sub functions? Because remember, they aren't even true AIs, they're sub functions. They're like one level below an AI, they're nearly there, but not quite. And then that code that was used to release Hades in the first game turned them into AIs. And since they're not used to being AIs, it freaks them out a bit. These were genetic pods. These were cloning pods, for, and this is an Elizabeth Sobek clone. Aloy. Is this Beta? you skins like ice must have cut this from her head but why oh it was a control device hello hello Elizabeth uh, apologies I don't know what else to call you um, my name is Beta I'm afraid I must be brief. I only have a few minutes before my keepers discover I'm missing, and I still need to remove this implant. I had hoped to find shelter with you, but if you're doing this, I, I may be dead. Be careful when you take on Farsiness. They are ruthless, and they have Aluthia, Artemis, and Apollo. They didn't have Aluthia and Artemis. But at least they don't have the Gaia kernel to merge them with. sister so she's she's still alive we could take her back to base we need to get her back to of course they show oh, up right shit. now shit they can fly they can fly now they fly now Aloy, can, can you hear me through this thing what's going on Aaron? two of those spectra things just fell out of the sky one of them is heading down towards you the other one's waiting up here we're coming up stay in cover until i get there you got it Get her to cover in that room. Whatever happens, she stays with us. She's gonna get taken. And we get to find fight one of their specters. I'll protect her. I should prepare before the specter gets here. I can't let it get through to Varl on the clone. Okay, so that's where their weak points are. And they jump. I should scan that thing. See if it has any weak spots. I did, and it does. And ow, 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 ow. These things are way more advanced than I'm used to. And scarier. Much, much scarier.
these things are like creepy robot octopuses. And they're annoyingly strong. Okay, let's heal, let's heal, let's heal, let's heal. You are annoying. I want to get rid of you. So it can hide its weak points. And part of what makes it so strong. Let's get out of here. Let's get to a lower area. I don't want to be cramped in there, but... They are strong, but not invincible. Okay, new plan. See how you like that. Okay, dodge out of the way of that. Trying to make some of these, don't worry, I'm not trying to kill you. Okay, that's a lot, of course I'm trying to kill you. Expose a lot of your weak points. That'll make my job a lot easier. Come at me. Come at me. Come on. Ooh. <laughs> Maybe you should stop trying to shoot me. Oh no, just never mind, don't fight, don't fight. Just just lay down and die. Just lay down and die. Never mind. I didn't mean what I said. I didn't mean it at all. No 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 no. No, 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 no. How about big no? How about big no? Big no. Big no. Hmm, lots of materials we got from that. There. Are you okay, Amy? I am. Uthia, yeah. Artemis, and Apollo. Well, they always had Apollo, so I'm not surprised now. about that part. Got They've it. had Apollo since Apollo the beginning. Once the coast is clear. Um, because they had a clone, a copy of Apollo. We knew about that. Eleuthia and Artemis, we didn't know about, which means now they can clone Elizabeth as many times as they want. And I forget which one Artemis. Oh, cloning food, uh, animals. I think. Got to get back up top and deal with that other specter. I just hope Aaron stays in cover. And Aaron's gonna be injured, I swear to God. Please don't be dead, Aaron. I really don't want Aaron to die. Aaron is one of my favorites. I love Aaron. He's so cool. And he, and he starts off as kind of like an idiot, but he gets a lot better. Aloy. Aloy. Ah. Aaron. Yeah, the Spectre sucking seals in. It's got me pinned down. Hang tight. I'm almost there. Just hurry. 
Okay, so it looks like he didn't try to fight it, which is good. He's not as brash as he was in the first minute. I gotta get to Aaron. Aaron, I'm here. Watch out. Watch out. That thing shooting down the center. Stay put. I'll see what I can do. And the second you need me, I'm there. Spectre's not budging from that spot. I might be able to sneak up on it if I stay out of its line of fire. Get up behind it. A heavy weapon. That could help. And get behind it. Shield's down. It's on the move. Dang it. Come on. A little faster. Just a little faster. Wait, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Hi. That was an accident. That was a prank, bro. It was a prank. It definitely makes it easier when there's two of us. I'm trying. This thing is really in love with me. Take it like a man. Or a woman. Sorry, I think we should change that phrase to take it like a woman. At least we can get some parts from it. Ooh, is this a new weapon for us? A new way to get around? I hope so. How long is it? How long have we been on stream, guys? Someone do an uptime for me? Hey, Beta. Aloy, uh, she's. Look, I swear I'm not drunk, but right now I'm seeing double. Long story, but it'll have to wait. She needs a healer. But we need to get her back to the base immediately. Zoe will help. Right. Yeah. Well, what are we waiting for then? You two go on ahead. I need to take another look at that weapon. So they were betrayed by their own clone. If I can figure out how that thing works, maybe the Xenos won't be so invincible after all. First, let's collect this for the pouch so we can use it later. Just full, but still pack has room. Oh, it looks like we got the materials already. Oh, the weapon over there. Oh, is it talking about the? Wait, I'm confused. What weapon? No. Damn it. The crystal survived, though. Gaia might be able to help us think of something with this. Well, it's better than nothing. I need to get the weapon fragment to Gaia to analyze. If we can replicate it, maybe we'll have a way to defeat the Zenus. I should check on the clone, too. Well, 
errand? You okay? Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, why wouldn't I be? Because there's two of me now. Hey, there's two of you now! Well, at least you seem to be handling it okay. <laughs> I wouldn't say that exactly, but I'm trying. I was hoping you could help me with something. It's about the Tanakh rebels, and it also has to do with the Osirum. Really? That doesn't Is sound it about good. the Sons of Prometheus? Let me know what I can do to help. I discovered an Osirum militant group. They call themselves the Sons of Prometheus. Oh, only four hours? Looks okay. Like we'll do a couple more missions then. For the Tanakh rebels. I thought there was something only you could do. They're familiar with ancient tech, and they're as anti Karja as it gets. So, last year we stopped Durval and his cronies from blowing up Meridian in retribution for the Red mm -hmm. And now you're telling me we have another group of Asaram trying to wipe out the Karja with, with an army of machines and bloodthirsty Tanakh? Yes, this is true. Pretty much. Oh, well, that's just great. Is there any way you can help me find out who they are? Anything to track them down and stop them? Yeah, I can send out some messages from Chainscript. Get in touch with my contacts in the claim. See what I can find out. I'd appreciate that. So what do you think of the Zenus after that? that you've you seen know that? what we're up against by now? Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. When Varl first told me those bastards come from the stars, I thought he'd eaten too many of those medicinal <laughs> Well, you know, it's understandable. I've gotten used to seeing impossible so. things, thanks to you. I just wish they weren't always trying to kill us. Yeah, you and me both. So how's the training coming along? I see Val gave you a focus. Well, it doesn't look as fashionable on me, but by the forge, the things I've been able to see. Granted, a lot of them are bad, you know, the old world emblem and such. I'm still trying to wrap my head around most of it, but I never really understood how you were ever able to find my sister back in the sun. Oh, I'm glad they brought up this part. And now I do, sort of. It makes me feel like I could be useful. You were already it useful. It takes some time, but yeah. But now you can be even better than you were before. And I'm happy about that. What are you reading next? I saw a guy I added something to the archives about metal rods being used to harness lightning during Oh, storm. lightning rods, yeah. That reminded me of a cousin of mine. Thought he could trap lightning if he covered himself in storm burn. Yeah, that doesn't sound Went smart. The tallest mountain in the claim to prove it. It ended like a lot of Osiram things do. With a spark and a boom. Anything else you're learning? What are you working on with your focus? I'm still figuring out how to read stuff on this thing. Those two lovebirds over there have been giving me a hand. But to be honest, all the little symbols, they give me a headache. But I'll get up to speed. I promise. How are you settling in? Yeah, Varl's been helping me get the lay of the land. When he's not getting all tongue tied. <laughs> I, I know what a way to play. more nervous, that Gaia lady or our new Utaru friend. Well, what about the Vanguard? Aren't you supposed to be back east, ordering them around? I sent some of them back to Meridian with a message. I doubt Avad will mind me sticking around to help the savior of Meridian. That's fair. Makes a lot of sense. What about the Tanakh guy? So, you've met our new Tanakh friend. He's, uh, quiet. I thought his people were supposed to be bloodthirsty maniacs. You shouldn't believe everything you hear. Yeah. Well, I guess if you trust him, so do I. He is trustworthy. That is definitely true. I still think the ending of the first game where she finds the original, her at the ruin of her home was kind of sad. Oh, it is sad. Oh, it is definitely. When she finds Elizabeth's dead body, that's like the closest thing she ever had to a mom. And all she finds is her dead body. It's it's a really sad ending. It's a bittersweet ending. She saved the world, found her place in it. Wake up till we brought her here. But she can't and find the one person did. she wanted to meet of all. I, I thought it'd be better if Zoe and Varl took care of her. No use crowding someone when they're in a state. So Talana came by the base. Yeah, more like rushed through. I was hoping she'd stay for a drink at least. Only car I've ever met who's any fun. <laughs> That's a nice but way of putting seemed it. Like she had more pressing matters to attend to. I have to get going. Don't go causing too much trouble. Yeah. Well, it's Aloy, so that's kind of a given. Aloy, 
you're back. Yeah, I'm just, uh, checking up on how everyone's doing. You mean, after meeting someone who looks exactly like you, but isn't you, down in the basement? Yeah, it's a little weird for me, too. Yes, this must be even stranger for you than it but is But I us. knew this could happen. Well, Varl said she may be able to help us in our mission, though. Maybe. So what are you working on? What else have you been up to? I've been studying Gaia's seedlings, the subfunctions. Mm -hmm. I wanted to understand why one of them would do what they did to Fa. Imagine my surprise when I looked into this Hephaestus and found out it helped create all machines, our land gods included. In a way, the Utaru owe Hephaestus our whole way of life, as well as our current troubles. That's why we Two have sides to of the came, same way. coin, peace and war. Tragedy and comedy. Learn Love anything and interesting lately? There's been much to read up on now that Aether has been reunited with Gaia. Oh. It's hard to imagine that machines like Stormbirds once helped heal the skies. That is what they were for. I used to be terrified of them as a child. Thunder still brings chills to my skin. Understandable but if you don't understand Gaia what Thunder and Lightning are. Purpose, no? Yeah. And if we can get Hephaestus back, she can get those Stormbirds in line. So what do you think of our new Tanakh friend? You said you met Beta? Varl mentioned she was hurt. I thought I'd offer her an extract to soothe the pain. That was kind of you. I just hope she doesn't plan on staying burrowed down there like that. She probably it won't. Looks like she's barely seen the light of day as it is. I need to get going. May the land bloom in your steps. What a beautiful statement. I like how they, one group is about the forge, the other one is about Mother's Heart, uh... The sacred land, as they called it, their sacred land. Another one is about the ten warriors by the blood of the ten, and then one is all about plants. I think I like the Utaru. Aloy, the Aloy. Most. there are more supplies in the chest. Help yourself. Hog. Uh, is this where you are? No. Is this Varl or is this? Uh, Looks like some of the holograms are working now. I have repurposed the displays to track Regala's activity in the region. A useful war map. Makes a lot of sense. I hope I'm not interrupting. No, but I must ask. The woman Varl and Aaron brought in, she's related to you. It's hard to explain. Um, she's more of a copy. Hmm. Good. I doubt like she's you, anything like me. She seems more like a slave Maybe. than a warrior. Unfortunately. When we were at the bulwark, the guard said something about the rings of the ten. Hikaru also mentioned it at the cool route. Deca too. What is it I called? want clones. I wouldn't want clones. I like being a unique one. The flew on great metal machines with wings. Leapt into battle from the sky. Oh, the jets. For us, to imitate this feat is the ultimate expression of martial prowess. And it is why the challengers leap into the arena during the cool route. Many times I imagined it as a child. The feeling of freedom. And the awe it must have inspired. What did Chief Akaro say when you told him he'd be joining me here? He spilt rebel blood at the grove and helped reunite the clans. There was little more to be said. He understood. Well, I'm honored he lent me his best marshal. At least for a little while. Indeed. <laughs> so what happened you between you and the Sky Clan exactly? Why time do you ago, not wish to return you home? Were part of the Sky Clan. Yes. That's all you're going to tell me? <laughs> Fine. As you wish. My parents were killed in a clan skirmish, so I was raised by my squad. As I grew older, I came to be known as an accomplished fighter. Kote took a special interest in me. I fought by his side against the Karja and led my squad on a dangerous climb into the Daunt. It was I who opened the gates at Baron Light. Oh, wow. You're side. the one... Allowing the Tanakh to raise it. That must have gotten you some attention. Wow. 
You're famous not just in this side, but on the other side as well. I was welcomed home as a hero. And I was content. Then why did you leave? I became a marshal. Why did you decide to become a marshal? Why did you leave the Sky Clan? To become a marshal. You want shadow clones? Shadow clones wouldn't be to too bad because then they wouldn't, difficulty. you know, disrupt Back your life, kind of like this one does. Order. Whether she wishes to or not. Like one would a father. I was too blind to see the fear in his eyes. Fear of a rising young warrior challenging his command of the clan. I returned a hero from the battle at Baron Light. But to him, I was only a threat. It never occurred to him that I had no interest in rising above my station. Ah, so then he schemed to make you a marshal, unfortunate. I wouldn't mind clones if it was like Naruto where they served a purpose and I can get rid of them when I want to. Exactly! But if you have clones like um, the guy from, uh, like twice from My Hero Academia, then you could Where's have some Kote problems. think he wouldn't be a threat to him if he sent you to the Cool Root? Dakote knew that if I survived the Cool Root, I'd be forced to forsake the clan to serve the Tanakh as a whole. I'd never be allowed to challenge his command, even if I wanted to. After our victory at Baron Light, Takote spoke to our people, said it would be selfish to rob Hikaru and the marshals of a warrior like myself. Even though he knew perfectly well, I had no intention of ever leaving. It was exile, guised as an honor. One he knew I couldn't refuse. So I became a marshal. And never looked back. Smart. I'm sorry you had to go through that. You took what was you took the poison that was given to you and turned it into time. a gift. Marshal is what that I was a wisdom that to very be. few ever learned to deal with. You said you if I had shadow clones, I would get my drawing skill back That's up right. to uh, scratch in hours instead of days. Holograms of your first fight Actually, though. That would be very useful for me, even, too. And more agile than any machines I've faced before. How many do the Zeniths have? I'm not sure. I'd probably get a second computer. Probably computer not. just for editing. I would not wish to face them. And I'd work on editing while the Shadow Clone yeah. worked on games, and then we'd switch places. Getting Uther out of the Grove made for quite a spectacle. One that showed the entire tribe that Hikaru's mission for peace is the correct path. It is now blessed by the ten themselves. I heard my friend Talana came by the base. Did you get a chance to meet her? Briefly. A bold woman going into Tanakh territory with that Karja armor of hers. <laughs> that is She'll quite be lucky bold. if my people don't shoot her on sight. She'll be careful. She's just looking for someone who might need her help. Whoever it is, they better be worth dying for. Have you had a chance to speak with Vol? Briefly. He fought well against Regala's troops at Baron Light. Are all Nora as skilled as the two of you? I'm not exactly one of them. But anyway, the Nora can hold their own. They managed to push the Karja from their lands. I thought my tribe was the only one to have done that. Impressive. <laughs> I like the way. I like how he just takes information that he didn't think existed before. And just shifts his mind to be like, all right, cool. Now I know this thing. Instead of being like, no, it can't be true. I'm... Blah, 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 blah. You know what I'm saying? I'd send the Shadow Clones to work for me. Uh, though I get why Twice went crazy. And it says he doesn't know if he's the original. Wouldn't uh, him still existing mean he's the original? Apparently, according to him, the clones can exist for as long as they don't take serious damage. I need to go. That's uh, what I think it then. is. And serious being like you have to at least like break an, break a limb or something at that level. Uh, where's Varl? Is he in here? No, that's the data room. This is the shared room. I went in here again by accident. Maybe he's in the tech room. Where'd Hikaru go? I 
I guess we'll find him easily enough. Let's talk to Beta first. She needs a friendly face. Hey, Lord. Oh, that's where we're Glad you made it back okay. She panicked after waking up and stumbled down here. I thought it best to wait for you. Makes sense. I'll talk to her. Hello? It's, uh, it's Beta, right? My name's Aloy. What's wrong? Is it your injury? Simulacrum withdrawal syndrome. I don't understand. Sudden removal of a neurologically integrated data device. The brain, especially the cerebellum, goes into a kind of sensory freeze. Ah, uh, so your senses are just kind of all over the place. place. Unreal. Distant. Is there anything that can help? You have a focus to spare. It's it's primitive, but I can make it work. Primitive? Yeah. What a way to speak of futuristic technology for me. Booting up. Oh, it's interesting. She puts it on the left, not the right. Like a mirror image. So, uh, Aloy, I suppose you want information about you and the Zeniths? Yeah. Why are they here? What do they want? How did they get you? Let, let's start at the beginning. I'm guessing they faked the destruction of their ship a thousand years ago. That seems consistent with their behavior. They wouldn't want to be followed. So far, Zenith established a Why do I feel like she's a spy? Yes, for a few hundred years. I don't think she left. wants to be a spy, but Some I think sort of she's still somehow a spy. natural disaster rendered it uninhabitable. Okay, so the descendants of Far Zenith escaped a dying planet, and now they want to claim Earth for themselves? Not their descendants. What? Not their descendants. It, it, it's them. The same ones who left Earth a thousand years ago. You didn't know? How can they still be alive? They don't even look... What did they do to themselves? I believe it's a combination of pharmaceutical, cellular treatments, and technological implants. And, and you? Does that mean that you are... I'm not like them. I was made. On the way to Earth. On the ship. Like how I was made? I spent years studying in my training interface. All so that I could serve my function. Access and control of the terraforming system. But why? What do the Zeniths want with it? When I discovered the Zero Dawn system had disseminated into its subcomponents, I thought my purpose was to fix it. But I don't think the Zeniths want that at all. I think they want to wipe Earth clean and start over. That's definitely true. It's goddamn Umbrella. Maybe. I don't know. It's hard to say. It... I think they can kind of, they kind of control her, but also I'm not sure. So the Zeniths want to exterminate life on Earth. That's what Gaia and I concluded too. But why? Why kill everyone just to take over? When they took me on missions with them, I saw how they butchered the tribal people we encountered. They didn't seem to care about a rejuvenated Earth, so I concluded that they must want a hard reboot of the system. Then they can redesign it to be exactly what they want. Mass extinction for their own comfort? Who thinks like that? People who've lived for well, thousands of years. Well, they'll have a hard time doing that. The Zeniths needed Elizabeth's gene print to access Zero Dawn facilities. So they made you. Trained you. And you went along with it? Not really by you choice. You told me I was born to interface with the Zero Dawn system. When we reached Earth, I pieced together what must have happened to Gaia and her subordinate functions. That's when I started to realize I wasn't meant to fix Gaia. That they must have made me so I could do what their remote extinction signal failed to do. Reboot Earth for their own benefit. So you know about the extinction signal? It's speculation, but... The only logical conclusion why Gaia suddenly self-destructed after operating efficiently for centuries. That makes a lot of sense. Only undertaken such a desperate course of action if it had detected a threat to life on Earth that was more dangerous than ceasing function altogether. I should have realized that she had also ordered the recreation of Elizabeth Sobek to rebuild her. Yeah, well... Surprise. Surprise. 
We should rename her from Beta Beta to Betty if she is on our side. So we're dealing with the same Farzinif people who once lived on Earth. What else do you know about them? They were some of the most affluent and powerful people on Earth. They controlled almost every major resource, every industry. Gerard commands them. He's the one who decided to set up a base. The others, Eric, Tilda, Babena, they resent his authority over them, but in the end, they always do what he says. Mm, so it's a tenuous Eric relationship at best. Is the one I fought back in the Hades Proving Lab. He enjoys hurting people. Yeah. I know. So where is the Zenith base? You mentioned the Zenith set up a base here on Earth. Where is it? Off the coast, I think. Ah. Whenever I had to go on missions, I was transported inside of a Spectre drone. I couldn't see anything outside. But I did overhear the Zeniths talking about it once. They were discussing setting up a perimeter energy shield to repel the local fauna. I'm certain they have other security measures. Spectre patrols, machine lures. It, it must be impregnable. Mm, nothing is impregnable. Base, launch facilities so they can shuttle back and forth to their ship in orbit. Plus infrastructure to gather materials and fabricate anything they need. Are there more Zeniths than the ones you met? Uh, I'm not sure. I, I suppose there must be more of them in the base or back on the ship. For all I know, there could be more of them out in space. Are there survivors of the colony? You said the Zenith's colony in the Sirius system was destroyed. What happened? All I was ever told was that a natural disaster forced them to leave Sirius. I've speculated that it was an extrasolar object or a cataclysmic seismic event. Or maybe even an abnormally violent coronal mass ejection from Sirius A. The Zeniths never told you any details. They said the only thing that mattered was that they survived. First Earth, a thousand years ago, and then Sirius. Guess they survived old age too. I think that what it was is there was such a fighting between each other, between the uh, different factions in Far Zenith, that the ones who actually destroyed it was themselves. It wasn't some natural disaster. It was them, and these are the same people who also ruined Earth thousands of years ago. And they'll do anything to make the world the way they like it. The death signal hit them too. Um, no, the death signal wouldn't hit them because it came from them. They're the ones who sent the death signal, and plus, they wouldn't have had a copy of Hades at the time. And the death sig all the death signal did was it allowed Hades to separate from Gaia, so it could take over the terraforming system and then activate its protocol, which is to reset everything at zero. How did you? So I don't think the death signal is what caused the problem. I mean, it's a possibility, but I don't think so. Even if I were to run, I'd never survive on my own in the wilds. Then I saw you. And I thought that maybe you could help me. So when the Zeniths pinpointed Aluthia's location in the biomedical research facility, I saw an opportunity. Smart. You said you saw an opportunity to escape when you went to capture Aluthia. What did you do, exactly? Whenever I was taken out on a mission to recover a subordinate function, only one of the Zeniths would go with me. The one the rebels killed outside the facility. Babena's dead? How did they bypass her shield? I'm looking into it. But you were talking about your escape? Well, when it was time to use the Zenith's transmitter to send Aluthia back to base, I also sent the encrypted transmission. Then I distracted Verbena long enough to seal myself in the ectogenic chamber, altering the facility's log so it appeared that there were only 236 containers. And the Gaia root kernel? I told them I could capture Luthia faster if I had it with me, and they believed me. Well done. And your origins. You said you were born on the way to Earth. In an artificial womb, I'm guessing? The Zeniths had an ectogenic chamber aboard the ship. An updated version of the one you found me in. They must have used a stored sample of Elizabeth's DNA. I doubt Elizabeth would have let them take her DNA. Do you know how they got it? That wasn't part of the archive I was allowed to access. They have an archive. Interesting. You said you spent years studying in a training interface. Was this archive you mentioned part of that? But only the parts I was permitted to access. 
Aristotle and Aspasia, the avatars of the Archive, would assign me learning modules and evaluate my progress. Wait, those names? They were designed to be the virtual guides for the Apollo database. Before Ted Farrow purged it, the Zenith's have a copy. So it still exists. I mean, I got to learn from it. Only what was deemed pertinent to the mission. If I requested information outside of my parameters, my tutors would deny it. To have all that knowledge just out of reach must have been frustrating. All right. All right. Well, that's enough that's conversation enough now. I hope you, Do you can get more comfortable. Or, so how long? You know, your, your, your plan. How long before Gaius fabricated a machine army to defeat the Zenith? How did you know optimal strategy? So, well, I still have to get two more subordinate functions before Gaius powerful enough to absorb Hephaestus. What? You don't have Hephaestus already? Is still figuring out how to capture it. It's not confined to a single to a single location. Of course not. You didn't even know who the Zeniths really are. You were supposed to be further along by now. We don't have a Apollo. Here was a mistake. They're gonna find me. They're gonna find this place and take me back. This was all for nothing. They're not going to find us. Guy is using Minerva to mask our location. What difference does it make? You're too far behind. We're never going to beat them. Everything. Everyone. We're going to die. Hey. Hey, everyone was going to die once Calm before, down. six months ago, and I stopped that. You're here now. All right, right, if I can stop that, I can stop this. So is there anything you can do to help? I have certain knowledge sets. Okay. And given your state of progress, expertise, you probably Then work. use it. Geoengineering, of course. Computer science, physics, biology, chemistry. Speaking of someone who knows well, physics... See if you can do something with that. Talk to Gaia. I'll check on you later. Where is Silens in all this? And why is he teaching others how to override machines? How'd it go? Her injury's not that bad. But I think she regrets coming here. Feeling might be mutual. Hmm. I'll come back later and talk to her. See if I can learn anything. I should get the weapon fragment to Gaia. Okay, let's see if we can make a new weapon to get rid of those dang shields, hopefully. Or at least start preparing one. We have a small elite task force here, ready and willing to learn all that they can. So any new information Welcome for back. and from Gaia would be useful. Hey, Lord. I see we have a new guest. So now we know the origin of the transmission. Yeah. I also recovered this. The weapon it was part of somehow stripped a zenith of its shield. But it malfunctioned and blew up. If we can recreate the weapon and improve it, maybe we'll gain the upper hand on the zenith. A moment. I will scan it. Complete. By combining the results with data from your focus, I can infer that the weapon was highly advanced, comparable to Zenith technology, but not how it worked. Did the explosion corrupt the data? It was only a catalyst. The moment the weapon malfunctioned, it appears a command executed to purge all data within its core. Ostensibly, this was to prevent the weapon's secrets from falling into enemy hands. Whoever designed this weapon knew how to cover their tracks. Silence. Mm. Based on your data on him, that is my so Silence is working well. with the Zenith, it seems. Then he's not going to cooperate with us. Well, it was worth a shot. But that's not all. The Zenith got Aluthia, along with Artemis and Apollo. That is unfortunate. However, our original plan remains unchanged. The two remaining subordinate functions should increase my heuristic processing density enough to absorb Hephaestus. Right. One problem at a time. Well, I guess I better get back out there. I wish you luck on your search. Right. Thanks, Gaia. 
So I guess we won't be making use of Silent's weapon. And now there is another clone of Elizabeth here with us. But I can't let it distract me. I still have two more sub functions to get. All right, Aaron, have fun with that. You're the one that helped me find it. People make mistakes. Hey. Uh, I love their friendship. Okay? Nothing some rest can't take care of. Are you okay? This beta thing. I called they had them. Even you did call they had them. Just try to take it one step at a time. It would it, it did explain why there were some missing. The good news is they don't have the Hades one because we purged that one entirely. Looks like I was wrong about the Zeniths. Their ship didn't explode on its way to Sirius like everyone thought. We saw how they lied about creating a better future at their launch facility. Guess they lied about what happened to their ship too. But still, a tribe settling amongst the stars. I couldn't put a single dent in their shields, Wolf. That one Zenith almost killed me. That didn't stop you from resurrecting Gaia. This is true. Won't stop us from using Hephaestus against them. Let's hope that's enough. What are you studying right Zell. now? Training with Zell. Well, no, training and other yes, stuff. Yes, training. Mostly. Look, she reads glyphs faster than I can already. I'd be a fool to refuse her. That help. is true. Of course. Makes a lot of sense. What have you been studying? You guys reading something over there? We just finished going through all the logs you collected back in Nora territory and all Mother Mountain. It's hard to imagine that my ancestors were trapped inside without the knowledge from Apollo to guide them. Thanks to Ted Farrow. Yeah. I wonder how it must have felt when they were finally free. The world must have seemed so beautiful. Not to mention terrifying. They weren't much more than kids. And they became an entire tribe. That's a very positive way of looking at it. I like... I love Varl's very positive idea. Imagine if Aaron discovered Doom soundtracks. Hey, maybe, for all we know, he could be listening to the Doom soundtracks. All I know is it's like a loud song, and it's got a high uh, uh, beat uh, RPM. A lot. I've actually been looking through the data to find ideas for a gift, and to thank her for helping me study the glyphs, something from the old world that she's never seen before. Instead, I found out they gave each other stuff Animals? Interesting, like a you teddy bear. Me, stuffing a dead animal with anything really doesn't sound like a good time for anyone. Yeah. Maybe Gaia can help you find something else. We didn't always do real stuffed animals, but some people do like our How taxidermy. Everyone dealing with beta. I tried explaining what a clone is to Aaron. He was totally lost. Then Zoe said something about two trees coming from one seed. That seemed to help a bit. That is actually quite accurate. So well done, Zell. And guessing you've spoken with Catalo? I wanted to pay my respects for those who fell when we were ambushed at the embassy. I told him I'd never seen anyone throw themselves at a machine like he did. He said a warrior shouldn't be praised for fulfilling their duty. For a second, I thought I was talking to my mother. <laughs> I never thought of tonight Very that similar. a Nora war chief could have so much in common. That is a very good way of I'm putting guessing Talana didn't stay for long. You got that right. Makes you wonder what this Amadis guy did to grab her attention. Whatever it was, she didn't tell me. Must be quite a story. I guess she'll tell us when she's ready. I hope Talana joins us at the end of this. Damn, more people How to talk to. Everyone handling their focus. And we all have our difficult moments. Aaron definitely curses the most. But I'm hoping Osiram's stubbornness prevails. How's everyone doing? Just taking it all in. No one snapped their bowstrings yet. Interesting way of putting it. How many more Someone is there? Settling in. Zoe's planning on bringing all kinds of plants in here. Says a home should always spring with life anew. I asked Aaron to help find some. I think he'd rather stick his head into a snap mall. Still, it's not a bad idea. Should liven up the place. It's true. We did have ways of putting plants in an office I like this. I should get this. back to the wilds. I'll keep an eye on Beta. Make sure she's smart. Clear. Okay.
So it looks like you have a there mission for me. There is something I'd like to discuss. Yes. It's about the land gods. If you have time, of course. Is. You said you wanted to talk about the land gods. I think there's a way to heal them so that they'll once again provide Plain Song with grain. Gaia gave me a set of instructions. She called it a uh, <coughs> reboot code. If we deliver it to the land gods, their derangement will end. Well, that's great. Uh, maybe. There are thorns on the path. Unless the code is given by Hephaestus, the land gods will reject it. Gaia showed me a way around this. We need components called control cores from machines made by Hephaestus. Machines similar to the land gods. You mean Grimhorns? Like the one we fought in the repair bay? Yes. Gaia helped me locate two of them out west. So, kill the machines, get the control cores, then use them to adapt the reboot code into something the land gods will obey? If all goes well, but taking down two Grimhorns won't be easy. We'll do it together. Bless you, Aloy. I'll send you the location of the machines. All right, well, we got a new I'll mission. I'll let you know when I get close to those Grimhorns. Good. If we can get their control cores, maybe we really can heal the land gods. That sounds like a good idea. Get some food for people. Like my stuffed human. Whoa, hold up. You have a stuffed human? How much did he eat? How much did you feed him? How much did you feed him, damn it? Tell me! Let's see. Oh, this is where the two grim homes are. Interesting. Oh, no, this is my next quest. You know, we can try this one now. Might as well. Oh, we got new... Uh, I know we saw a flame claw strider. Hmm, it's only showing one as far as Zenith bot, so I'm guessing there's only going to be two in the whole game. These one looks so sleek kind of creepy how sleek they look all right let's head you know how to tell when a pizza is cooked perfectly when the cheese looks like molten metal oh not incorrect depends on the metal but you're not incorrect I only say that because some metals have odd colors to them. All right, let's try opening this place up so people can get back to the back to the claim, back to chain scrape. Seems like that signal must be close. And we have some um, skill points to use. Hmm. Let's make ourselves even more hidden. I don't use the smoke bombs much. Okay, silent strike deals more damage. Looks like it has two levels, but I don't. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, that one would be really useful. I don't know why I didn't go for that. I'm a fool. Wait, is there a?
Interesting, interesting. So there's separate ones. We use less materials while we do this here, so that's a good thing. So that's why I'm doing it while I'm... Hello, go over. Orange and bubbly. I know, I know what you mean. And I'm like, that, you know, that is correct, so. It works, I guess you could say. We should probably sell some of our junk. I miss in the first game where there was just a sell all junk option. That was a nice quality of life buff. Have I got news for you, Red? Uh, you probably have, but I'm gonna go do a mission real quick. So let's let's go do that instead. Chat, after I finish fighting this, um actually let's save first. We should probably save, do two saves, because we haven't saved in a hot minute, and we finished a lot of missions. Got something you want to hear, Red? Water, shelter. Uh, so after we kill this, uh, what you call uh, the rock breaker, should we continue the stream or should we just end it there? Up to you guys. Actually, you know what? I think I should just end the stream. Because i got to get to editing the other streams that we haven't done in a while. And I think a lot of people have probably left by now. They're probably all tired out. Which is understandable. People get sleepy. I see I saw huh I guess it doesn't matter okay let's try finding a rock breaker I like how it respawned the valuables cache for me. That's nice. The rock breaker, eh? I must have attacked the officer as they were passing through. Okay, let's try to get to. Can we get to the high ground up there? Sacred ingredient for someone, I'll bet. something up there which means we can get up there. Oh, they set up a bunch of stuff for me to be able to shoot it with ice. Perfect. I forgot they do that.
Where is it? Where is it? It hit something. I hate rock breakers, they're so annoying. ourselves up. God, this is the most annoying enemy type in the game. jumped into me. Stop slithering around. Come face me like a man. Face me like a robo-man. Where are you? Have to surface now. Fucking hell. Yo, yo, yo. It's low. It's getting there. If we can blast it with some ice again, it should go down. Come at me, you coward. Just, are you a man or are you a machine?
Give up. I have the high ground. We defeated it. Well, that's one rock breaker that won't be troubling anyone anymore. Oh, so we must have entered we the beat a rock breaker. Well done, team. I'll let me take a look. That one wrecking ball testicles. It looks like a Decepticon from the sec. Oh, um, oh, I know what its name is too. I think it's called like Ground Wave or something. I only know from the ride. Awesome, awesome. That was a cool thing to get a hold of. That wall looks like it came down when the rock break us must have run into the western tunnel. Let's get to the other side. I should be able to blow this up to clear the debris. What am I supposed to do here? Destroy the obstruction. Do I need some type of fire arrow? Do I even have a weapon that has fire arrows? I have this weapon. And why am I not using it? The way out. The tunnel should be clear now. Oh, what Porgeth know? I didn't see a car jam on your bed. Maybe Jelana's friend made it through. Let us hope by the sun that you are correct. Maybe I should look for Porgeth's lockbox before I move on. Oh, hi, Nightshade. Are you waking up from a nap? Waking up from a nap, kitty? Oh, nap kitty. You want to come say hi to the chat? Hi, it's me, Nightshade. And I would just like to thank each and every one of you for stopping by during the stream so that way I can get special treats. So thank you. Here's a kitty wave. Meow, 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 meow. Such a good kitty. Oh, such a good stream kitty. Yeah, you're a good stream kitty. Oh, who deserves a kitty hug? You know, she'll sit on my lap when I play games sometimes. The Decepticon you're referring to is Rampage. Is that its name? I thought it was like Wave Blaster or something. I don't remember. It's been so long since I've been These on that ride. Must be the supplies the second crew is supposed to bring. That's the only reason I know the name because they don't mention his name his once in the. Box was supposed to be among them. In the in the in the in the movies, at least I don't. I think they do. Not what I meant to do, but you know, uh, kill it and cook it. As I always say. What be this? Horgriff's lockbox. I should take it back to him. Well, this is something I still can't get into, right? Or maybe it's just a visual thing? I don't remember. It's nice that they add these uh, little things for you uh, for the, uh, the ammo type that you're strong against. Or that the thing is weak against, I should say. Metal bone. The bones of the metal ones. Looks like I could. Climb I just know it from push. the guy saying, "I, uh, I am Maybe underneath enemies. Uh, the enemy scrotum." Would you say they're a child of Bahamut or child of Tiamat? Oh, I'm a child of. Um, I'm probably. I would be a child of. Um, oh, I'm trying to remember its name. Oh, 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 oh. 
had its name memorized. Let me look it up real quick. I have it on my phone. Uh, I would be a child of uh, Sardior. S A R D I O R. Sardior. So neither really. The source of that signal must be close. I know. I know you're talking about Bahamut, uh, the pal uh, the Paladin Dragon, and Tiamat, the five-headed dragon of evil. Uh, the mother of the. Of the well, they're both the parents of, but the metallic and the chromatic dragons. But I am a child of Sardior. Yeah, I know. I, I well, technically they're both the parents, actually, according to the lore. So what it really is is that, uh, so there are multiple tellings of the different lore. One of the lores is that Tiamat, Sardior, and Bahamut all work together to try and make the dragons together and as they were being ma uh, they made the first chromatic dragon together and then uh, Tiamat corrupted them so she would control them and then to combat her corruption uh, Bahamut and Sardior made the um, the the metallic dragons to create a balance Have I got news for you, Red? hello can I talk to you Hello? Is this glitched? Maybe if I wait or something? Maybe I'll talk to this guy first. A child of Helm. You might want to avoid going too deep into the desert, especially the southwest. One of our scouts ran into some nasty Tanakhs down there, the kind that contain machines. Good to know. He barely made it back alive. Thanks for letting me know. The rebels are as friendly as ever. Talana. Ah, uh, Talana. Glad to see you made it. Thanks to the secret passage through your base. It was quite a sight. Secret passage? Don't let the others hear you say that, or you'll have a lot of Asura knocking at your door. And you are? This is Raggart. He's a scout with this caravan. He says Amadis was here. He joined up with our expedition right before we went through the tunnel. After we made camp here, I set out to do some scouting. I also made peace offerings to the Tanakh for trespassing in their territory. Amadis wanted me to ask around about some place called... The Rot. Rot. I've heard that what before. What did you find out? Most I learned was that it's where the Tanakh took their prisoners. Somewhere far to the west near Thornmarsh, the Lowland Clan's capital. He set out to find it not long after. Uh, on his own? I tried to warn him, but... I am an amethyst dragon to answer your question. One of the gem What dragons. happens when you went through the tunnel? Nothing. Our crew split into two groups to pass through. Everyone here was part of the first crossing. Aside from some pitch black passages, it was quiet. Whatever befell the second group spared us. Steel spark be praised. It was a rock breaker. Tore right through the caravan. Ugh. Ender dragons are not a thing in D&D. John, I know what you're trying to do. We're talking Pogba. about D&D dragons. There's only three. Chroma well, there's actually a lot more than three. But there's three bases. Did the Chromatic, about metallic, into the rot. and gem. Not. And then there's other there's space dragons, words. like uh, the astral him. dragon. I like the astral dragon a lot. Those are cool. Did he They're also okay fucking terrifying. More or less. He seemed shaken when we learned the tunnel had collapsed behind us. But then again, so was everyone around here. So you're a scout for this crew. Anything I should know about the area? Where to start? Down south, we got a trio of Osirum trying to delve into the ruins in the sand. There are more of you? They're the ones we followed out here in the first place. And then there are all the other folk who broke away as soon as we got to this side of the tunnel. Salvagers, explorers, all sorts of daring venturers. Just how many of you were there? Enough to lose track, that's for sure. I've also spotted some rebels a while back, too. Seems like they've been patrolling the desert. Heard all about the rebellion from the Tanakh up in Scalding Spear. 
That's the Desert Clan's capital, north of here. Sounds like you've really gotten to know the area. It's what I do. Thanks, Roger. This has been helpful. Hope you find them. Uh, how do you fight okay. wraiths? I'll head for Thormarsh. Meet me there. Hold on. What do you what? mean? You're willing to go to the ends of Tanakh's territory to find this guy. No hesitation. Of course, he's one man alone in the Forbidden West. I'm just worried about him. I think it's more than that. I'll meet you near the Lowland capital. But then, you're going to tell me who Amadis really is. Fine. I'll lay low, north of the village. See you there. She's being weirdly hostile about the whole thing. Let's see. So, if we add all the days lost to being stuck in camp nowhere, and throw in some hazard pay, because no doubt the crew will demand it, but reduce the number of the crew by half. Oh, and can't forget the Savior's Delvin fee. Oh, might just break even. You're back. How's that tunnel looking? Way's clear now. At least he's not a complete dick about it. Like, he wants his money, but he won't. He's willing to give a fair share of, you know, hazard pay. You didn't happen to find my lockbox now, did you? Here you go. Spark in the dark. Is there nothing you can't do? That looks like a very old lockbox. And look at the lock on it. Or is that part of the opening mechanism? Here, your fee as promised. Now that the threat's gone, I'll have the tunnel shored up and cleared out. Then I can send for another crew, get this expedition going proper like. Ah! Onwards to the delve. Put the rebel outpost down, did you? Uh, I have Good. Eight more suits Only a matter of time before they raid this big site. Uh another look in week in sunlight, but what about in the dark? Uh I don't know uh they're the Yeah, I know the newest fishman race in D D. Race needs silver or enchanted we weapons. If I remember correctly, it's only... Uh, I don't think it's silver. Uh, I know that for werewolves, you can use silver and enchanted. But I think it depends on the edition you're playing. I would actually make it where it's not even enchanted weapons for uh, werewolves, only silver. Just, just to make them more unique. Uh... All right, we have a new rebel camp. Oh, right, the, the, the races. I almost forgot we have races. Should we try the bulwark melee pit one more time? Let's try it before we end the stream. If we don't finish it after five tries, let's say. I think I'm reset, ready to go. Flick, I'm still being afflicted. The power of the pizza. The pizza will never be you. I'm coming, I'm coming. I think at night I'll make some burgers. Just who I was waiting to see. I've set up something new for you, if you're up new. for it. Bring your blade, Outlander. This is fear. Not what do you mean? Brother, survive. All I'm doing is dodging. That's not fear. That's a desire to not get hit. You know, like that. I am not done. Me. Enough. Not counting that over. one. A girl Maybe I knew crested time. a campaign where weapons enchanted with moon glow healed werewolves. Interesting. I like that. That's actually very cool. I like I like how people come up with their own stuff. Even if I don't agree with the way that people do stuff, I like their unique ideas for D and D campaigns. I would really like to start running my D and D campaign, but all my friends didn't want to play it. Right now. Which I get it. There we go. That's the hardest arm to hit. Where is 
I'm playing this so bad. You all right? Where did she learn that? My blade hasn't fallen. You don't train to fight. Oh, that's so unfair. That is unfair. I was stunned, and then as soon as I get up, they kick me. According to Andrew, Moonlight is Sunlight. Wouldn't they be a werewolf all the time? Well, t mag logically, Moonlight is Sunlight, but in like a mathematic sense, or not mathematic, sorry, in a mystical sense, Moonlight, the Sunlight changes to Moonlight when it bounces off the moon, so it has different properties than Sunlight. That's how I always rationalize in my brain. No more practice. Because magic works different than logical science. My blade. Excellent combination. That's what we call unfair. This one is hard. Use what you were taught. Good combination. Good work. Enough training. Fight. You need conviction. Brother. Did you take You have met. I don't really know if I was evading, but sure. Excellent combination. Good work. And now I evade. Because he's going to have this weird stun. Oh, I did it! Oh, we did it! Oh my god, thank god we did it. Oh, that was close. You're tough. Yatta! Let's go! Here, burn this mark. Will that be our victory dance? Good luck getting your final mark. Kill Big Boy first. And let me know if you want to rematch another challenge or more training. You'll always be welcome here. Okay, we got the Sky Clan mark. We got the Desert Clan I mark. If you want now we just need again, the Ocean we'll Clan mark, I think, is the last place. Um, let's quick save. Oh, the snow's coming down heavy. Hmm. We'll set up to do uh, this mission, and we'll save for now because it is pretty late in the day, and I want to make some dinner. I want to go to sleep and maybe possibly play with my friends before then, and I got to work on the videos for uh, the week. So, guys, we're going to end it there. Uh, let's see. Who do we have to raid? Hi, kitty. You're kind of in the way, so I'm gonna need you to move, you little fluff. What, you don't want to move? You don't want to move? You don't want to move, you cute kitty? You want to just say hi? Oh, that's a fluffy kitty. That's a fluffy kitty. Uh, oh, well, wait, but
before you go, let's go raid. You'll get more points if you raid, guys. Come on. Let us raid. Let, let's see who there is to raid. We can go raid. Let's go raid uh, Jeremy. We haven't uh, been in his chat in a bit. So we'll go raid him. <coughs> All right, guys. Uh, so let's... Here are the raid messages. Folks, you guys know what to do if you've been here before. Let's go raid them. Zagger's cat brought me here. Pog champ or Zagger uses dragon powers and now I'm here. Schnacky schnacky. If you are subscribed, if you are not, then that is all you need to know. Guys, let us... I can't wait to see you all tomorrow for Pokemon Fridays, Fainting Fridays, Pokemon Fire Red, Nuzlocke. There we go. Finally got it out. We'll be continuing. We'll finally probably go against Brock. I got to do some grinding off screen before I forget. We'll see you all tomorrow. It has been great having you here. I've had so much fun. I'm loving this game so much still. Ah, and Andrew's so far ahead of me. It kind of makes me mad. But remember, more, more important than that, stay safe, stay smart, stay healthy. Always be thankful for everything. And most importantly, don't believe in yourself. Believe in me, who believes in you.